Hello, hello, dearest people. I am Neon Ice Wings, and we are continuing our game of Pokemon Yellow. With Bit Crush po po Pokemon, I keep forgetting that Pikachu is that bit crushed. But we're going to continue. Today, we are going to help liberate Silphco from the nasty hands of Rocket. He doesn't know that I'm standing here. But he will. No kids are allowed in here. I'm not just any kid. I'm God. And I'm here to beat you up if you're just two Pokemon. I've got six. Well, we found the Cubone that was taken away. Profound sadness. I think, yeah, I think Cubone did a hefty damage to my poor, my poor salad in the past. So we're going to throw in. Different dude. What move even is Bone Club? Bubble Beam. That's not what Bone Club is. Bone Club! It's a water type move, obviously. And bite. That poor, poor Cubone's not gonna get any rest. Who should we try and give next? Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're fighting a Zubat, so actually Ivysaur would, should be do decent. I don't think that it has any moves that can annihilate my boy. Fine attack. Oh yeah, I forgot. I keep forgetting that. I'm used to the the type of Zubat that's just like, Mrr. And I also forget that they have supersonic confusion all around. Nothing but pain and misery. There's the pain. The misery is determined by how far it goes. Not that much misery. Huzzah. Oh, critical hit. Yay. Why would you do that? I'm already confused. And it's not like I was unconfused the very next round, so it's not even like you're cheating. Another critical hit. This is <laughs> Wing attack, eh? Super effective, and yet it did less damage than Bite. Poor Zubat. Tough! Exclamation! Heal up the dudes and the boys. But yeah, I was just reading up some uh, TV tropes, because what else are you going to do with your life? I was like, I'm going to look up TV tropes uh, on Pokemon Yellow. Apparently, yes. Oh, okay, I thought you were going to be a scientist who was going to be nice, but no. It's off limits here. Go home. Apparently, they don't want to be saved, which means I get to beat them all up. Unless he's a rocket scientist. Nah, he's just a scientist. He's an asshole. Yeah, I was just reading, like, the Pokemon red and blue and yellow... TV Tropes page is to be oh yeah, I forgot that Sonic Boom exists. But there's no real point to Growl because Growl uh, affects the attack stat, whereas Sonic Boom should be a special stat move. And I don't... Is there even a, a lower special stat move move in this game? And of course... With all the times I use Thunder Shock, hardly ever paralyzed. Random Magnemite is like I use, I get paralyzed, and I get critical hits, so I win. My win. I was about to send out a Voltorb. I'll go ahead and uh, who should have next? Charmeleon, you try out. Please don't get blown up. Every time I see a Voltorb, I'm just like, oh no, maybe it will. Aha, it failed, but my leer, my leer, it gets you. How do you even screech? You're a ball. All right, Ember. Quit screeching at me. If I had screech, I'd be content to use it once. Oh, that's why. Survive, boy. You probably won't because he screeched you multiple times. Holy hell, it was a critical hit and he survived. My Charmeleon is God! It's 
Screw it, let's go. We'll double team and then quick attack. Because I don't think doing it multiple times does anything. I just do it out of habit. That's one thing. I don't know much about Pokemon rules. Like how to do things. Oh, I know. It's going to take forever. How about Thunderbolt? How much damage does a Thunderbolt do in relation to a tackle? About the same. Fair. Quick attack. And I will just be here for a little while. Haha, <laughs> you're electric. Knowing this game, Sonic Boom is probably normal. But at the same time, that goes flies in my face of it's a special attack there, man. Double team coming in clutch. Saving my peak too much pain. You're good. I won his respect. Now I get to have the run of the place. Can you solve the maze in here? He went from I don't want to be saved to polite conversation. What an odd scientist. But we'll explore a bit more before we take that teleportoir. See if there's anything to the left. No, there's a teleporter. So I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> if this was Assassin's Creed, he'd be dead. He doesn't even know. Hello, scientist. You're causing us problems! I can only assume you're a rocket scientist. Grime. No, not the grime war. Vine Whip! You can't do that. Although, actually, I think it can. Because as I was... Well, it's not very effective. Mm. As I was reading... Disable in later generations works by targeting the last move that was used. Whereas I think in this generation it just picks a random one at random. Because that's what random means. Have you ever picked something intentionally by random chance? I don't think so. That would fly in the face of our Lord and Savior, our in Jesus. Oh, uh, yeah, mm, mm, paralysis, mm. You ever see a puddle of disgustingness just smiggity smack up your, your salad? Oh, it's fully paralyzed. You can do it, my boy! Gonna send out Electrode, huh? Nope. But let's see what Goblin does. It has a big smile. I don't like that smile. Use a shy beam. How dare you screech at my beloved boy! Follow up with a confusion. How dare you use light screen? It's just rude. Quit hiding behind your light screen. No idea why you do that. You're gonna die. And you have no friends to save you. Huh? I lost? And then I take his pension. Darn, it needs a card key. No, not the card key. Nobody has cards anymore. It's all digital. And we'll fight you. I am one of the four Rocket Brothers. Oh no, the real Elite Four is here. Oh no, not the wazing. 
Uh, yeah, because I think poison won't do much. Like, uh, grass does not do much against poison, which I guess is a... Elemental. No, not elemental. Environmental message. Not very effective, my ass. That looked very effective. Hey, goblin, murder this guy for me. You have messed up now. Confusion! How dare you not die? Confusion! He has leveled up. I can't wait till I can get the... I'm just gonna have... No, I don't want to. I'm gonna... I pro... Actually, I could have probably sent out uh, Pikachu to fight you. Oh well, confusion. I'm falling into... Complacence. I have to think. Is like, what is word that brain wants to use? It has to flip through the physical pages of my mind. Yeah, he did it. Trying to learn recover. Can't learn more than four moves. I don't think I'll use that. Mainly because it's just like, hey, heal in battle. That's what potions are for. I'll use Pikachu. He sent out a, a wheezing. The evolved form of this guy. And then sent out a coughing. Why? Double Y. Quick attack. Don't let him get a hit in. Jesus Christ. Your physical moves are so weak. So weak. And of course you get a critical hit to finish it off. But at least he leveled up. Woo, oh brothers! Woo. Oh brothers. Oh no, it's we're fighting the the brothers of Ric Flair. Oh, can we rest? Come on to bed, so let me rest. He's like, nobody would rest in the middle of a hostile takeover. That's what this is. <laughs> I can do the walk. I'll run circles around you. That's as far as you go. I honestly doubt that. Ah, oh, yes, four Pokemon. Eradicate, eh? It's a normal type. So use Growl. How dare you? <laughs> what are the chances of it being like, oh, it flinched. Oh, it's paralyzed. Back to back. Back? I want my boy to level up. Uh, huh. Will you fuck off? Oh, I get criticals. I hate, I hate how criticals are d d defined in this game. Fine whip. Oh, and now that I'm, well, I just, hmm, actually, hmm. I hate hyper fang. It's such an annoying move. And let me guess, it'll be a crit. Why? <laughs> Why can't you be normally calculated? No, you don't get to use Ivasaur. No, you don't get to. Hmm. It's just like, I want to level up my other people. And then it's just like, no, you don't get to. It's just kind of annoying.
Keep using Bubble Beam. Drown it in bubbles. I'm sure that's possible. About to use Gold Bat. Sure, I'll throw up Pikachu for this one. Just keep swapping out Pokemon. Maybe because I just want to feed it a Thunderbolt. Die. About to use a Rattata. I shall send out Charmeleon. And then this Rattata will use Hyper Fang and get crits upon crits upon crits because that is what the Lord does. Growl. Ah, oh, it's using Focus Energy. Ah. Because yeah, a part of me wonders, like, what the specifics of these, like, uh, abilities are. Like, because some attacks you can do multiple times to make them, like, more effective. And then there's some moves that are effective at 100% by only one use. And then you just don't know which ones are which. Not enough grit! And now I can just walk down here. This is a different area. Okay, that teleporter sent me somewhere. Okay, that teleporter sent me. This isn't even the ground floor, Jesus Christ! How big is this? Ah! I think now we're at the ground floor. I'm just like. Oh, this just, for some reason, I'm like, oh yeah, teleporter. It just sent me up one. No. No. It sent me way up. Quick, goblin, teleport me. Hopefully I went to this place's... And... Yep, you did. Good. Because there's always that little bit of fear whenever I use teleporter for the first time. It's like, did I uh, go to the this town's Pokemon Center? Hopefully I did. And now I gotta use me bicycle. No, not don't ride the Max Potion. And we're gonna also go to the store, stock up on potions. I would like to buy some hypo potions. Some hype potions. And I guess a few great balls. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe if I... Because... Oh, I can't carry any more items. Meh. I can sell that during my... Uh, TV Tropes Wanderings, apparently the accuracy makes things 100% accurate, so I'm gonna keep that. And then I'll have to make sure to stop by and put away some things. Yeah, just 10 for now. Alright, and uh, actually we will teleport back to the Pokemon Center. Just because I think it's faster. We'll put away some more items. I'm gonna keep the X accuracy on me. Hmm. And I probably should put away the... Uh... No, not Bill's PC. Hmm. Show up. Mine. Deposit. I'll put away my Pokeballs. I'll put away the Moonstones. No idea why he still had these. And I'll put away the HMs, because I already use them, and there's not much use for them afterwards. Unless you want to teach it to another Pokemon, in which case, why would you? You can't unlearn them, apparently. So what's the point? And we're going to keep the Poke Flute because we still need to wake up uh, the dude Snorlax. Very famous. That's why it attracted Team Rocket. Bicycle. Do 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 do. 
All right. And we will continue our teleporter shenanigans. Wait, did, did we go over here before? Here's a teleporter. Yeah, this is the teleporter we used. Yep, yep. Let's try this teleporter. See where it sends us. Haha, <laughs> behind the door. Hello there, dude. I wonder if Sylph is finished. Okay, this guy's just locked in here. Don't know why you have a teleporter into your locked room. Hello there. Can you solve the maze in here? Okay, this... These three teleporters are highly redundant. <laughs> already went in there. There's nothing but beds. And this guy's like, this is as far as you go. Alright, we'll take the teleporter back to the bottom floor and go up one. Just because, I don't know, my brain likes to do things in order. Although it is entirely possible that that one teleporter that sent me into the locked room actually didn't. And it was actually just uh, a room that's very similar to that locked room. So it made me think that I just went into the other place. Yeah, I'm just like double checking that I got everything on the floor. Yes, so we go up one. And there's automatically a teleporter. Let's clear this floor as much as possible. Alright, so there's two teleporters up here. But I want to make sure that I get everything as much as possible, like, down here. Quit messing with us, kid! I will mess with you as much as I want, because I am your lord and master. <laughs> I hate you. Yeah, I'm just gonna side-beam you to death, because I hate radicates now. They just, it, it's mainly just like, eh, I'm gonna do superpower kicking him. And just like, my poor, poor salad, my Ivasaur, does not have the luxury of enough damage to outpace their quick attacks and their bloody crits. Like that. About to use Hypno. Sure. Striker, you can deal with Hypno. You can throw sand in his eyes! The first pocket sand of the day! Pocket sand! He can't hypnotize you if he can't see you. Apparently he had things to say about that. Quick deck. Haha, <laughs> you missed, fool. Let's see, is Gus better than Quick Attack, or are they basically the same? Well, that just ruins my entire thing. It's like if you're having a... Uh, what's the word? A control group of people, just for whatever reason, and then one of the people turns out to be Superman. Your control group is now useless. But hey, he didn't get any headbots off, so that works for me. Stay out there. You can sandblast his eyes until they're nothing. Sand attack is another one of those things. I don't know if using it multiple times in a row actually does anything. Ah, uh, And, like, I don't want to go and look it up too much. Like, certain things like, hey, where can I get flash? I think that's a... a, a, a I think that's a normal thing to want to look up. Because you don't want to go into a freaking cave of darkness and not be able to know where you're going. You want to actually be able to progress somewhat generously. I give up! Ah, the quit messing with us to I give up pipeline. I work for Sylph. What should I do? I work for Sylph. Not worked. Although at the way uh, the rate things are going. Jesus, there's so many teleporters in this one place. Well, I might as well start with this one. Where we go? That's that's such a useless teleporter. That's 
such a useless teleporter. The only reason that teleporter would... Uh, maybe it's to train you to... Nope. What's 09? The collapse of the housing market. Take down. No idea if that's good or not. Yeah, at first I was like, oh, maybe this is to teach you that the teleporters on this floor go up one or down one. No. They're just random. It's just like, useless teleporter, go. You're hiding? Eek, no, stop, help. Oh, you're not with Team Rocket, I thought. I'm sorry, here, please take this. TM36. I just get a lot of items and I don't want them. What's TM36? I don't think so. No. Mm, no, no thank you. I wonder what this says. It's a Pokemon report. Four Pokemon evolved only when traded by Link Cable. Hmm. Considering that this is just teleported up to a place that can be gotten to normally... I shall just go upstairs. Because I am weird like that. I'm quirky. Give me money. Go ahead and use up some... Uh, they don't really need that. But we will put Charmeleon in front. Because I think he might have a better time, if only slightly. He doesn't see me. We should get a bonus. We surprised him. Intruder spotted! You're not gonna find... It's, it's it's like a conference room. Why aren't you up there looking at the entrance? You're in here sitting at a table. What are you doing, you schmuck man? You ugly boy. That's normal, so that will be cut in half. Yay. And then I'll leer and start attacking. It's the leer of, I'm coming for that ass. Oh, you bastard. And now I'll scratch. No, not the poison sting. Wait, I'm paralyzed. I can't get poison. Ha, joke's on you, idiot. I can't get poisoned. I'm already paralyzed. No idea why that this world works like that. We will let Pikachu have some fun. Pikachu just wants to murder you. Thunder Shack. Critical hit. At the back of my mind, it's just like, hey, maybe I can use this to see how it is. No, just immediate. It dead. Goodbye. Go home. My poor Ivysaur, everything seems just like... It makes me not want to use it. It was Water Gun. How dare you live at my turtle boy. That doesn't look like a Water Gun. That looks like... I don't know. I don't know, it's like Drizzle. War Turtle use Drizzle. Who are you? I'm the kid that's going to dismantle a criminal syndicate. <laughs> Menacing laugh. Uh, you want to fight? Team Rocket has taken command of Silvco. Well, that's what you say, mate. Hmm. He's gonna use Karate Chop. I was just like, maybe I should let this fight play out. Then I remember you have Karate Chop, and it makes me want to make you suffer. Especially because now they're using tactics. Before, when I was just like, I'm gonna get critical because Karate Chop is normal for some reason, which apparently get fixed later, along with Gust, which just makes you think, why was this even in the first place? Bill? I shall growl, just in case he uses Pound or something, if so that... 
Just, it'll be nice. Use Vine Whip. Jesus Christ. Oh! Because you know plants are... Why even? <laughs> because you know plants are scared of mind energy. I'll go ahead and use a super potion on the boy. Well, he became confused. Hmm, leer. He's so confused that when he tried to leer, he probably gave himself eye strain. And now I have to go use a hyper potion. And now Ember. Confuse no more! All right, that didn't work out much. I guess that's true. It probably has a high special because it's psychic. You bastard! That's so stupid! I already selected it. Shouldn't I be able to disable something that my guy was in the middle of using? Who are you? Uh, Sombra from Overwatch? Here all along. Yeah, my boy did it. Arg. And now there are teleporters to be had. Yeah, why is it like everything is super powerful? Or at the very least, annoying to fight with my Ivasaur. He won't level up at this rate. My poor boy. My poor boy. Alright, wrong button. Now let's go use some teleporters. That's useless to me. I want teleporters that take me to places I can't get to normally. Hello there. Why, well, I'm scared. You should be, because you're in the presence of God. Me. Hey, you want to fight? My Pokemon are my loyal soldiers. Huh. Loyal Soldiers has won. Growl. In case he wants to, like, tackle or something. And now we'll leer. Well, luckily I'm not going to use, and that's something I should have taken into account. Ember is a special attack. So, using Leer won't help because special dictates both special attack and defense in this game. Why, though? But why, though? But why, though? You weak Pokemon! You ordered it to self-destruct! You utter psychopath! My Pokemon is weak. I mean, uh, no argument there. It got my Charmeleon down to half health and detonated and still didn't knock him out. How do you even do that? Wow, that's just a, a chain of nothing for me. All I got out of that was a Pokemon battle. Like I said, I'm looking for routes through the teleporters that will get me to places that I can't get normally. Just... teleporting... 
Huh. Once again, a, pl <laughs> a child intruder? That must be you! How did you even hear about that? You're behind a locked door. Oh no. Not Sanshran. <gasps> hey, Ivasaur! We finally found someone that you might be able to fight a little bit! Or is Rock able to do damage decent to plant? I don't know. I s even after playing this a bit, I'm still like, what is the typing matchups? Like, apparently, Psychic is powerful against Diddly D. Grass. Because you know. Okay, Grout. Oh, but it failed. Growl. Okay, I'm going to just stop because it's doing the Persian thing of pissing me off. <laughs> Basically, if my thing to try and lower stat doesn't work two times in a row, I'm a give up. I'm just gonna give up. I'm not going to go down that path of madness. Could be just that one uh, sand attack, the pocket sand in my eyes. But I don't know. And plus, he's not doing that much normal attack anyway. Even though the growl would have been nice. Why do you have to hurt my feelings? Why do you have to hurt my feelings, Sand Slash? I am enraged at the thought of criticals. Tackle. <laughs> Stop pouring sand into my salad. Quit pouring sand into my salad. Ah! Oh! I'm just gonna. One of these days, I got potions. Oh, you king crits. <laughs> Also doesn't help that it's like, attacks themselves are dictated by their accuracy. Each one has its own accuracy, so. And I don't know them because they did Try to learn ladies and leave. Oh. Let's see what moves we have. Tackle, but... Mm, sure. I'll just have to get into the habit of swapping between my Pokemon for things. Fine, I lost. And now we have to teleport out. I want to go down that path, so... We're gonna save. We're gonna lure the rocket uh, up as far as possible. Actually, that won't work. I was going to be like, we'll lure the rocket out. But you can't do that because the only way he passed him is through a teleport. And if you leave the room, he resets. So, yeah, that's not going to work. Okay, they're getting higher level. Oh, no. I'm Wait, ah, no, I was going to use Leer because uh, I'm getting to the habits. Eh. Well, at the same time, eh. Why are there so many moves that are just like, oh, you're... Mm -hmm. There's, like, way too much in this game that it's just like, yeah, your turn doesn't happen. <laughs> you can flinch, paralyze, misses in general. Confusion, rap. There's just so many little things that can make it hard for you to actually get your turn off. Oh, that's a critical hit, huh? Nope. No. <laughs> Let me guess, Thunderbolt? Oh, double team. Well, that's kind of sad, but still, Thunderbolt. Jesus Christ, why? Uh, it's probably because he has a high special, but still. Mmm, hate you. Die.
You're just annoying. Why does he have such a high special, apparently? <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna try and use double team. Try and survive, Pikachu. Well, that didn't work. And just because you annoyed me, I'm gonna use a high potion on my Pikachu. Let's try Twi Quick Attack. Meh. <laughs> Couldn't you round up a little bit more on my attack so he doesn't leave with one health? What an aggravating jerk. Hmm, I'm trying to think who should be put in first now. Let's put in Striker. Who are you? What? There shouldn't be any children here? Too bad, there is. I'm the winner. Huh, Juggler. What's a juggler doing at Sylphco? <gasps> Side attack! No! Just attack! Beat him down! Kinesis? That's annoying. We just... He, he has psychic pocket sand, oh no! Uh, of course. Because, no, we can't have just a normal fight. He, the enemy has to have five billion things. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> I'm just annoyed at this point. I was going to use Ivasaur, but I was like, oh, yeah, the game's kind of a dick. <laughs> at this point, I'm just like, can just crits not exist in this game. It's gone to that point. Fuck off. Fuck off. I'm super annoyed at crits now. They just happen too often. They sh Basically, it should be physically impossible for crits to happen two times in a row. <laughs> they supposed, they're supposed to be random, interesting things, not normal occurrences. I hate it so much. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> you missed, asshole. Great V Rose, then I'll just use Thunderbolt. Of course you do, because that's fair. I'm going to raise my defense and my defense. So on the one side, you have just Crits McGee, and on the other side, you have Mr. Turtle. Oh, goodness! God, you're just annoying. It's a Pokemon report. Pokemon Lab created Porygon, the first virtual reality Pokemon. It'll only be seen in one episode. Hey, Kadabra made a comeback. Maybe <laughs> Porygon will. I don't even know what floor we were on. Yeah, there are just way too many crits in this game. Basically, if you want to convince people that crits are bad for Team Fortress 2, just show them this. But at the same time, that's a multiplayer game with quick respawns, not an RPG. 
in which you're basically like, I want to have a chance. And you're just like, no, you don't get a chance. Good God, just imagine playing this version of Pokemon Generation 1, and f just imagine if Brock had greater crit potential. Horror. Horror. Fear. And now we're going to go to the store to pick up more potions. Because we're just using all of them. Because Jesus Christ. Like, I guess I could just let my Pokemon faint more, but I don't want to do that. I want to be a good Pokemon trainer. And then I guess I could sell... the TMs, because I have no use for them, so I might as well. I'm never going to use them. I hardly use, uh, TMs as it is, and it's only when it's just, like, think that it might be useful or a good move, but this is Pokemon Generation 1. It'll already be hard to tell if a move's decent off the top of my head, not ever being in to the competitive of Pokemon, so I have no idea if... <laughs> Alright, just go up until we get to little corner guy. I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This place is so wonky due to the teleporters, it's hard to tell where's what. Fight me. We study Pokeball technology on this floor. Does it look like I... Oh, that's what the juggler is for, I guess. Oh, now this is terrible. No. Maybe I know. Pikachu, go! Magneton isn't steel type yet, so this shouldn't do much to you. Why not? What is. Is Sonic Boom an aerial move or what? <laughs> because that should freaking be like. An electric move, in my mind. For whatever reason, all this time is just like, yeah, it's an electric move or something. Apparently not. What the fuck? What is Sonic Boom? <laughs> Pokemon Generation 1's making me super annoyed at everything. And it's just like, sure, I was like, I don't want to make my Pokemon faint. I don't want to... It's like the hierarchy, don't want to make my Pokemon faint. It's like, what move is Sonic Boom? It doesn't seem to be affected by Growl and other such moves, so it has to be a special move. So I guess it's a flying move all of a sudden. Predominantly used on Voltorbs! Ah! He's about to use a coughing. I'm no more Mr. Nice Guy. I'm gonna try and use as much, as much type advantage as I can because I am just, no, I'm done playing nice. Oh, you have poison? Die. Oh, yep, you stay out there. Murder. I'll just have to deal with the imbalance of levels when I get the diddly D experience share. Now you can stay out, because I have no idea what types to use on you, apparently. I have nothing that's decent. Dang, blast it. Well, you can say one thing. This kitty RPG 
is d doesn't hold up. <laughs> uh, doesn't mess around. I heard a kid was wandering around. Yeah, basically. They don't hold back. Hmm, an Arbok. Let's see if Striker can handle him. Let me guess it's gonna poison him one. We'll use two sand attacks. Fuck you. <laughs> One more! One more! Pour sand in its eyes! It annoyed me! Eh, <laughs> fool. You paralyzed my guy. My guy... uses the normal gust. Quick! Attack! Booyah! That wasn't too bad. Mainly because I abused the one thing. Sand attack, pocket sand. Oh, let me guess. This is behind the rocket grunt. No, it's not behind the rocket grunt, okay? What's your deal? Your Pokemon have weak points. I can nail them. Don't talk about my Pokemon that way creepy. And you have a creepy face. Oh boy, it's Voltorb. And from now on, I'm just gonna send Goblin out to deal with electric types, because I don't have anything... Why? Why? Well, this works out perfectly, because coughing is weak! My- your Pokémon have weak points. Proceeds to be ineffectual. You probably could have gotten the same damage out of a Sonic Boom. So far, electric types have been annoying. But not so much as freaking Bellsprout. I probably should have healed. I overestimated Goblin. But that's why we have Hyper Potions. Hyper Potions! To match your ego! This is when Logan would have been nice. Why is you doing good with the frickin' Paralyze on Thundershock, but I, I use Thundershock all over the place of Pikachu, and it hardly ever happens? What the hell? I'm annoyed. It's fully paralyzed. Uh. But at least he leveled up. You hammered me! Nail, hammer, you're not an engineer, you're a scientist. Shut up. And we can get here normally, so back down we go. Because, again, my methodology is to go through the teleporters and only really care where they send me when it comes to... Uh, I wish I had fly so I could go get, like, smaller potions. Oh, hey, Pokeball. Hey, I got the card key. Now I can open up all the doors. Now I can just go floor to floor open and door. Floor to floor, opening door. Open sesame. The card key opened the door. I think we've already been here. Because I think there was a Pokeball in here. But let's try the teleporter. Yep, normal. What do you think of all this, Pikachu? Pikachu adores the slaughter. Aha! Open sesame! 
protein. I have no idea what that increases, and it, the game won't tell. Pikachu, you're so weak. I'm so sorry. I'll give it to Striker. Hey, that works because all he has is normal attacks! Can you tell that I'm angry? I'm not angry. I'm infuriated. Hello. Team Rocket is in an uproar over some intruder. That's you, right? Hell yeah, and I freed you. There's literally no reason to go in there except to talk to that guy. I find that hilarious. If Pokemon was an Ubisoft RPG, that would be a hidden objective. Free all the scientists. Hey, you want to fight? Oh, we already fought you. The way this place is laid out, I kind of thought that, uh... We hadn't. Hmm. Bongo. Lots of... I found a full heal, which is not a heal at all. Max revive. Oh god, those are godsend. And escape rope. When the time comes to buy up max revives, mmm, joy. Shh, can't you see I'm hiding? Kind of an efficient hiding. Because people know, just like, Ugh, go do perimeter search. Sylphco. Security breach. And now I can open this door, too. I am a magical boy. I can open this door, too. Hey, you want to fight? I support Team Rocket more than I support Sylph. Is this commentary on unions? Fear the union. They'll support a criminal organization over you. Sand attack! I hate you. Or at least now I know that's a normal attack, so... My boy can fight you. Oh hey, light screen. It won't do anything because all I have is normal attacks! Lol. Is that just their modus operandi? Oh, he's trying to learn. <gasps> yes. Razor Wind. I'm never going to use it. I keep thinking, oh, hey. It, I swear. I swear to God. I swear to God that if freaking... I'll, use, I'll try and use Charmander. Or Charmander, Charmeleon. They begin with the name Char, Char. Uh, uh, Charmum. I leer at you, sultrily. And now, Scratch. Hmm. Since he's doing a bunch of tackling, we'll growl him. And now he uses Smog, because he's an asshole. Oh! Well, it didn't say that it's uh, not effective, so I don't know. And now my boy's poisoned. Mm. I just want to fight you with interesting Pokemon. I keep forgetting that my modus operandi should be to smiggity smack him with super powerful attacks. But I'm just like, but I want to actually play the game. <laughs> I want to level up my Pokemon. I want to use them all in different fights. And then the game comes back to remind you, like those three asparagus or whatever the hell from VeggieTales, allow us to introduce ourselves. Of course you survive, because he's a smug jerk. Just look at that face, he's smug. No, not smog. Smog! You need to learn to spell wheezing. Why does it take the Pidgey line to level 30? 
to learn an aerial attack. Ah! I don't think we can even teleport out of here because I think it has to do with buildings, but let's fight you. Your Pokemon seem to adore you, kid. Is that a threat to take them away from me? I think it is. Ugh. A psychic on psychic fight. With my guy paralyzed. Hey, let's see how good he is. Uh, is my guy gonna be paralyzed on top of confused? Who wins? Confusion or Psybeam? Huh. It actually kind of works okay. <gasps> it confused. I did it for a time that I see that he's confused. Yeah. I slurp up the wonder. Slurp up the wonder, baby. And now we can use confusion to finish him off. Or he'll... Aw. Uh, I was gonna have hope that he would have finished himself off. But he didn't. Yeah, might as well stay out there because it's super effective. Confusion. Stay out there. Psybeam him for pure anger. And now, let's see. We probably can't teleport. Can't teleport right now. No idea why. Maybe Selfco has an anti-psychic policy. But hey, it gives us an excuse to use the elevator. To the first floor! And I have no idea what floor we were on again. Neat confused. Maybe we'll make it before my dude faints from the poison. Nope, he's gonna die. Feet away from Nurse Joy's healing counter. Death. Ah, he survived. It's a miracle on 34th Street. Slowly whittling them down. Slowly but surely whittling them down. Suddenly I have the urge to... Because a part of me was just like, what if the Pokemon anime actually followed the games? Because, you know, I, my brain comes up with the most original thoughts. And then my brain was just like, wait, isn't that just Pokemon Evolutions or whatever it was that follows, like, the original? I think there's actually been two special Pokemon animes that are kind of like short series. There was the one that was like, hey, P Pokemon Red and Blue or Red and Green, but, uh, it fo but it's an anime, basically. And then there was Pokemon Evolutions, I think, that had its final episode recently. Which was Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and Let's Go Pikachu, but it's an anime. So yeah, it's just... Diddly dee. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think again, where were we? Because my brain, it moves so fast that it forgets things. It's like a supercomputer. 
but I can only remember the last bit that it that it came across. That rotten president! He shouldn't have sent me to the Dixie branch! Oh, Jesus. Go, Goblin. You're my answer to electric types because none of my uh, ground or rock type are leveled up. <laughs> and even then, it doesn't really matter because apparently Sonic Boom is not an electric move, which most of, like, the only electric moves I've seen used by normal trainer Pokemon are th is Thundershock. None of them use anything. It's like, oh, Sonic Boom, and it was used by all these electric types. So I thought, oh, it must be an electric type move. Apparently not. <laughs> so now it begs the question, is that a different move? Or, like, is it a different elemental move, or is it a normal move? And if it's a normal move, what the... And once again, I am very annoyed that... The enemy uh, seem to have bias in that they get paralysis effect off of Thundershock much more than my Pikachu does. Wah. And I have to keep using Goblin, who is overpowered, apparently. Let's see. You gonna send out a coffin? Nah, I'm gonna keep my dude. He's super effective. And I wouldn't have it any other way. Ah! Bingo bongo. An HP up. And another X accuracy. One of those two awesome to use things. You dare betray team to betray, 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 who are you? Traitor, error. I guess I could throw up Pikachu, get him some. Oh, of course. But you can't thundershock your way out of this. Pikachu can say it. We need to level him up a bit. He's my main man, after all. I forgot you were confused. Darn. Yay! Murder time. Now Pikachu can stay out there and murder. Because now he should be confused no more. Ha cha cha. I win. You traitor. I never joined you. Who do you think that I am? Cuz I'm not. If you stand for justice, you betray evil. That is what I did. They must have targeted Sylph for our Pokemon products. Team Rocket is trying to conquer the world with Pokemon. The Rockets came and took over the building. And nobody has helped any of you. Oh dear, oh dear, help me, please. Look at him, he's such a coward. I am one of the four Rocket Brothers. You are probably going to be a reused hashtag. 
I forgot to heal up my dudes. I think. But hey, Psybeam. Of course you're gonna, it's gonna kill Goblin, isn't it? Huh. God damn it! He was like, oh hey, he, did, he got a crit and he didn't die. Oh hey, everything's pain. Ah. Paralyze is too effective, and Karate Chop is too effective. Quit using Karate Chop! <laughs> it's just like, there's no use to, like, not using... It's like, it's like, I don't want to use anything to heal the Paralyzed, because it's just going to be put right back on! For all I know, Machoke is just going to be like, I'm going to use the special nerve move, and I'll paralyze your Pokemon again. Flame out! Did I teleport in or what? No. I am just in pain and agony. Let's fight this man. I'm one of the four Rocket Brothers. Cubone, huh? Then I shall send out War Turtle. Bubble Beam. Bubble Beam, the small crying child. Ah, yeah, stay out there and use your tears to tear up the world of these small orphans. Brothers, I lost! TMO3, haven't we already gotten that one? Are there even that many, like, TMs in the game? Oh yeah, I forgot we have HP up. Who gets it? Pikachu again, because Pikachu is perpetually the lowest of health at all the times, apparently. TMO3. Swords Dance. I don't know what Swords Dance does. I'm gonna hold on to it and then after we beat up Team Rocket some more, I'll look it up or something. No, wrong one. Fight me. Aha, I smell a little rat. Still don't know what that one guy's on about. Traitor. I mean, they offered me to join. Hey, would you like to join our criminal organization? And I said no. They gave me a nugget. But that's it. Of course you get a credit card because you're an asshole. Luckily, I'm abusing the game to death. Stay out there. Beat him up, boyo. Stupid you. I'm already paralyzed. I can't be poisoned. Stay out there. Part of me is just like, hey, we can do the thing. We can send out a different Pokemon and try to level them up. He's like, no, no. I'm done being good. After this, I'm going to run straight to Fatruzia City and, well, I don't- I think you need to catch a certain number of Pokémon. And now we'll throw out Pikachu so he can have some fun because he's special effective against this guy. But yeah, uh, what I'll probably do... 
is wander about some places and catch some Pokemon I don't have. To hopefully get a certain amount and hopefully get the EXP share. Agility. No, I don't, I don't, I don't, is agility, no. The crits are determined. Thundershock is kind of pointless to me because I have Thunderbolt and Thundershock never gives me paralyze, so I can do agility double team and then hopefully things will be nice and he'll be able to crit everyone to death, maybe. Because a speed determines crits in this game. Lights out! You, it's really dangerous here. You came to save me? You can't! What? Team Rocket was after the Master Ball, which will catch any Pokemon! It would be bad if Team Rocket took over Sylph or our Pokemon. I'm trying to think. Did I take that that teleporter down here? I don't know. Do I need to heal any of my Pokemon? Because I think I saw Gary in here. So I need to be safe. Yep, I think I made the right choice. Help! I'm a Sylph employee! Would you like a casual, uh, casual danger d dialogue demon fight with our monster pets? Psybeam. Asshole. Come at me, bro. I have Psy Beams for you. You can't poison me. I'm already paralyzed. It's like the poison can't progress through my system, but that's not what paralysis is. Paralysis is like muscles. Poison is in the blood. My guy, he's just out here leveling up like crazy because i he's the only one that I have to fight off all the poison types that are here. Which means he's going to be super powerful, but all my normal Pokemon are going to be low level. And, like, what else can I do? These are annoying Pokemon to fight. And if I try to go back on my ways of, like, oh, I'll try and do it normally and actually play the game. No, you have to game the game. Playing only leads to pain. How did I know you? How did you know I was a rocket? because every other scientist in this damn building has been, too. Huh? Huh. This is the first floor, I think? No. But I do remember seeing that lady, but we fought you already. <coughs> Bleh. Well, either way, back up we go. So let's go down here. <laughs> you mistook me for a sylph worker? Actually, no, not really. Only two, let me guess. It's gonna fucking blow up like an asshole. Quick spam confusion! I really want to know what 
type Sonic Boom is. It's going to haunt me forever now. Make him confused, or just kill him. Okay, that works. No self-destruct for you. He's about to use Muck. Well, that's not going to work out for him. I thought you were going to be a little less of, uh, leveled. For some reason. I'm just over-leveling Goblin. Because this game is using Pokemon that I can't easily fight. I found calcium. Oh boy. I have no... I, I forget what calcium... I, I Really, I should just be giving these to Goblin because he's going to be my carry. He's going to carry me all the way. Well, that extra, that extra works. <laughs> Ah! I'm gonna save again. You gonna fight me? Ah. <laughs> we were already up here. Bingo, bongo, card key, worko. I wonder if Sylph is finished. Uh, did we... Have we teleported through here before? Yes, we have. There's, doesn't seem to be... Wait, I think we actually fought this guy before. Exploiting weak spots does work! Think about element types! Okay, no reason for... Just a randomly locked area. Ah, you're gonna fight me? You're gonna die? I'm one of the four Rocket Brothers, eh? You're gonna be the last one. Time to kill a dynasty. Now I would take mercy on you and that Pikachu have some fun, but I just want you to die. In for a penny, in for a pound. About to send out Drowsy. Yeah, we'll have Pikachu. Agility! Well, actually... We will double team agility Thunderbolt. Agility! And now quick attack. Because he probably has high special. Quit trying to put my Pikachu to sleep. You're not a certified doctor. That's gonna make you confused, isn't it? Ah, it didn't. It's a miracle! Any other day, that would have been mean. Ah, sure. Let's try and- Oh, I forgot! Psychics are powerful against grass for some reason! Or is Ivasaur continued po considered poison? It's entirely possible that Ivasaur is considered poison. Like, poison and. Yeah, we're going to growl. Of course. Growl, and then once we wake up, we'll use Leer. And then we'll scratch him up some. At least he's being stupid while I'm asleep. He keeps trying to disable things. Luckily, I already did that, so leer.
And now my poor boy's gonna get confused, ain't he? Oh no, yay. Scratch. Ooh boy, critical hit at that, which just means that it normally doesn't do that much damage and now I'm sad. Like, I swear that this this game, or the Generation 1, wasn't as hard as this, from what I remember. It could just be that younger me just ground out against uh, uh, to certain levels a lot more than I do. I'm playing this quite normally, all things considered. Warg! Brothers, I lost! He didn't even give me much money. Is this a midpoint heal? You look tired. You should take a quick nap. Yes! Yay! Yay! If I knew that was there, I would have run here immediately. Speedrun strats. But if I had started as a trainer your age. So we already bought him. Blah. Blah. But okay. We unlocked the heal room. That works out for me. I don't think there's much else to do here. Yeah, there's just not much on this level. Fight me if you dare. Enough of your silly games. Enough about you. I know, like, the only reason I'm still going to be using my use goblin to destroy you all is because... Mainly because, uh, efficiency's sake. And I don't have to worry about going to Nurse Joy anymore. Mwahaha. <laughs> and if I really want, I don't even have to use my potions nearly as much. I'll keep them out mainly because type effectiveness and I'm done playing nice against the AI. I just realized I'm kind of becoming Giovanni. No, continues left. And by that I mean I'm just throwing so many attacks at my foes that there's nothing they can do. My one guy is just leveling up so much. Yeah, we already went through here. Like, my one Pokemon is leveling up so much that <laughs> it's gonna be like, here's a bunch of level, normal level Pokemon, and then this one obscene monster. Welcome to Floor 10. So good of you to join me. So good of you to soon die. Why do you have only one? You know, you think you're hot shit. But I have been grinding my goblin into power because he's my most powerful Pokemon. And it just works like that. <laughs> I'm stunned! Carbos? Yeah, I'm just gonna give these all to Goblin because I'm done playing nice with this game. Except rare candy. I'll sell, I'll sell the rare candy. TM26. I wonder what that is. First, Carbos we will give to the boy. Speed Rose. That'll help. He'll get more crits. And then TM26. Earthquake. That won't help me against most electric types anyway. And I'm not sure if I have any Pokemon that could learn it. Blah, 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 blah. Like, it might be useful with, like, an X accuracy. Wait, I almost missed you. Hold! Do you have an appointment with my boss? No. Mainly because I don't care to make one. Hmm. 
Hmm, a normal Pokemon. Too bad it's gotta die. Mainly because I am done playing nice. If I had to... Uh, if there wasn't a turn, like, penalty for that, I would have played normally, but no. No. Hey, Aratata. We'll send out my boy. Hopefully he'll be able to do decently. Because it's normal, we'll use Growl. And now, Razor Leaf! Booyah! Zubat, huh? That sounds like a job for Pikachu. Thunderbolt! Another Rattata, huh? We shall send out War Turtle. Let him get some level up in. Another thing I realized, I kept using Tail Whip and then using my Bubble Beam when that doesn't really do anything. Tail Whip would only really work if I used Bite. Ekans! Eh, yeah, sure, we'll finish off with Goblin. Mainly because I have no time for your shenanigans. I am not a nice person anymore. I have succumbed to the meta. But not enough to actually look up what stats are or anything or for moves and stuff. Mostly just, is it going to be immediately efficient? Then I shall grind you into paste. Trying to learn psychic. Sure, what moves do we have? Disable, get rid of that. I'm never gonna use it because it's unreliable. Now I have three psychic attacks. Gah, demolished! And now I'm gonna head back down, rest at the place, see if I can remember where it is. I think it's only two down? Yeah, it was only two down. And then I still need to find Gary and fight him. <laughs> we still need to fight Gary with my overleveled abomination. I didn't mean for him to become this powerful. And we also haven't gotten Lapras yet. I could have sworn. Eh? I guess we have to find a teleporter that we haven't gone through. All right, let's just go through every teleporter we see. Coming down here. Yeah, because they all just kind of weave onto each other. Guess they, that's what they meant. This is a maze. got too cocky when it came to my card key. as well. Might as well. Where are... And tell... Well, of course there wouldn't be teleporters in here. They locked the door. Nope, this doesn't lead to a teleporter either. How do I get to Gary? For the final place. Rawr. 
Lord, I am full of rage. So it seems to be 11 floors. Yep, 11 floors. We'll double check. Yeah, yeah, nothing. Just a guy who's like, do you have an appointment? And there's no teleporter here. Hmm. I'm gonna start from the bottom again. To f well, I guess more like floor two, because the bottom would be reception. We don't need reception. Doesn't help that there are many kind of useless rooms. Blarg. At least this has nothing to do with the pain and misery. Of everything else, because, yeah, I think that just takes me inside. here, so I guess we'll go down? Using teleporters messes up your sense of level. Oh, we already... Let's try you. See if you can lead me to a new place. Nope. the answer, Mr. Krabs. Oh, hey. What kept you, Neon? Gangsters. <laughs> I thought you'd turn up if I waited here. I guess Team Rocket slowed you down. Not that I care. I saw you in Saffron, so I decided to see if you got better. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Psybeam. I would have used War Turtle to try and deedly dee, but that's scary. Magneton. Uh, I'm gonna stay out. Psybeam. Haha, <laughs> you missed. You failed. You're a failure, Gary. My goblin is going to... Okay, why didn't that... Oh, and now he became confused. And now I'm confused. It's a whole confusion battle. Confusion battle royale. Why did he get out of his confusion so easily? Why is the AI so cheatsy doodles? I don't think I've ever had confusion go out that quickly. Nine tails, huh? War turtle. See how you deal against a nine tails, especially that it's higher level than you. But hey, what are you gonna do? Fool. I use special attacks. Ah, that was a critical hit. And speed fell. Apparently it wants to die. Yeah, this Nine Tails did absolutely nothing. That's kind of funny and sad. <coughs> 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 
trying to learn withdrawal. I don't care about that, really. No. Yes. I was about to use Kadabra. Then I shall send out Charmeleon. More than likely, he only has psychic attacks to use. So I'm going to leer at him. And now scratch him to death. Haha, <laughs> you haven't been damaged yet. Why did you try and recover? You had nothing to recover from. Fool, let me guess it's gonna be Scratchkin, isn't it? No, it was Ember, yay. And then it was disabled no more, what? That was super fast. Oh, it was a critical hit, that's why. <laughs> ah, why did you make him into Vaporeon? I have a Pikachu! Well, it is a high level. Double team! And he used Aurora Beam. Uh, thunder? And hope it misses if it lives? Oh, Jesus. No, not town map. <laughs> Oak appeared in my head. Now's not the time to do that. Wow, fat load of good my diddly d did. Agility! Haha, it missed! Thunderbolt! Quit sand attacking my Pikachu! Quit sand attacking my Pikachu! Quit sand attacking my Pikachu! Why did it hit? You know what this song and dance is gonna be, Gary? It's gonna be the Miscapades. Yay! And it was a crit. Yay! No idea why you made it a Vaporeon. Uh-oh, so you are ready for Boss Rocket. Well, Neon, I'm moving on up and ahead. By checking my Pokedex, I'm starting to see what's strong and how they evolve. I'm going to the Pokemon League to boot out the Elite Four. I'll become the world's most powerful trainer. Neon, well, good luck to you. Don't sweat it. Smell ya! Oh, hi. You're not a rocket. You came to save us? Why, thank you. I want you to have this Pokemon for saving us. Nah, yeah, it can stay Lapras. It's Lapras. It's very intelligent. We kept it in the lab, but it'll be much better off with you. I think you'll be a good trainer for Lapras. It's a good swimmer. It'll give you a lift. I'll Hyper Potion you, and then Goblin as well, just because Boss Rocket is up ahead. Geovan. Geovanny. Hold it, hold it right there, brat. Our boss is in a meeting. You better not disturb him. Ah, they disappeared. Too many sprites on the screen, I guess. Jesse and James want to fight. Go, Goblin! Psybeam. About to use Arbok? Nah. Psybeam. Oh, it was a critical hit, too. Sucks to be you.
about to muse me out. Then I shall send out Striker. He could use some leveling. <gasps> Sand attack his eyes! <gasps> Sand attack his eyes! Pour sand in till he can't see no more. Then, wing attack. It's finally a flying move! A flying move! It's a miracle! L like always. Team Rocket's blasting off at the speed of light! Again! Well, guess I'm ready to fight you. I bet I'll save just in case. Knock, knock. Ah, Neon, so we meet again. The President and I are discussing a vital business proposition. Keep your nose out of grown-up matters. Or experience a world of pain. I kind of like how that worked out. He kind of walked beside me, but is looking... <laughs> kind of side-eyeing me. Nidorino. Goblin. Goblin. Psychic. My beloved goblin, I'll destroy you. How about we play this round again? Double team! Ah, it's faster than me. Damn it. It got a crit, didn't it? There you go. I was willing to be nice, but you had to be an asshole. Psychic. Too late for that. Definitely with that critical hit. A Rhyhorn, huh? War Turtle will handle this again. I think War Turtle handled it last time, too. Even with six levels down, Bubble Beam. Booyah! And we'll swap back around to Goblin. And of course, Psychic. Toss that Needle Queen out the window. I lost again? Blast it all. You ruined our plans for Sylph. But Team Rocket will never fall. Neon, never forget that all Pokemon exist for Team Rocket. I must go, but I shall return. Thank you for rescuing all of us. We admire your courage. I saved Silphco. Thank you for saving Silph. I will never forget you saved us in our moment of peril. I have to thank you in some way. Because I am rich, I can give you anything. Here, maybe this will do. And now I can leave. And get that experience share. Well, probably not because... Do you have anything new to say? Now they say the world. Saved us at last. Thank you. But yeah, more than likely, I think I need to catch quite a few Pokemon before I can get the experience share. Which is a little annoying, but at the same time, fair. Poor Pikachu. Poor, poor Pikachu. Pokemon Yellow version, though it seems that Pikachu is the weakest Pokemon. 
Yeah, Team Rocket is gone! It's safe to go out again! And I guess I could try out against the Psychic Gym. Oh boy, more teleporters. Because, I mean, we're here, Team Rocket's gone, we might as well try and beat... Hmm. I'm not sure what level her gym will be in general. Especially because I'm not sure if Goblin will help us all the way through. But we might as well check it out. I saw Rocket Boss escaping Silph's building. But we're gonna go to the store, because of course we- Ah! I flew here on my Pidgeot when I read about Sylph. It's already over. I missed the media action. When do I get fly? Well, let's go ahead and try out the new gym that is now available. I find it funny, there's Jim, and then there's Jim Jim. How come I didn't see you at the grass, uh, the grass gym? Yo, champ in the making! Sabrina's Pokemon use psychic power instead of force! Fighting Pokemon are weak against psychic Pokemon. They got cream, they get creamed before they can even aim a punch! Hmm. I guess I'll try Charmeleon out in here. Dang it. I want to go back and fight this guy so I can gauge the gym. Sabrina is young, but she's also our leader. You won't reach her easily. This guy's the point is a gym challenge. Psychic wants to battle. Ah, crap. It's a goddamn water type. Hey, Ivasaur, maybe you have a chance here until it uses confusion because for some reason plants is weak to psychic. <laughs> yes, yes, I already said that it's potentially because of the possible poison that flows in Ivasaur, but still, it's very silly. You can stay out and conquer these slowpokes. With Razor Leaf! Okay, critical hits galore, apparently. Oh, a slow bro, huh? He looks angry. Give him some Razor Leaves. Critical hit, and it survived. Oh no. Why are you growling? I don't use normal attacks. Booyah! Ivasaur was useful at long last! I lost my concentration! You gonna fight me too? You know that power alone isn't enough. Which is hilarious, considering that psychic power is the most powerful thing in this entire game. Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime. Uh, Leer. Ah, greatly lows. I think I better just get to scratching, shouldn't I? This is going to take a while. Profound sadness. Why? Fine, I'll send out Goblin and see what he can do.
Let's use the most powerful psychic attack. And see it do like 10 damage. Hi, you Psy Beam. I hate barrier fighters like you. Hey, I'm just gonna raise my defenses. Raise my defenses. Just annoying. It's kind of sad that this is probably the best way to fight this gym. They can't hurt me, I can't hurt them. But I can hurt them slightly more than they can't hurt me. My first level 40 Pokemon. Kadabra. I'm gonna try Striker out. Who knows, maybe Psychics are weak to flying for some reason. Sand Attack. Sand Attack. You can't recover, you're already hurt. You're not hurt at all, that's what I meant, bleh. Wing Attack. Wing Attack. Of course you would. Booyah! So I should probably use Striker up front more, probably. Poor Charmeleon, he's not getting any good use. Does our unseen power scare you? I have the goblin. I have nothing to fear. Even here. Ah, he has four Pokemon. Oh dear. Sand attack! Why are you trying to recover? I haven't hurt you yet. And one more. For good measure. Because he's being weird. Let me guess, quick attack? Uh -huh. Oh, you're gonna be an annoying gust to fight, aren't you? Don't forget that stab damage! It's, I know BLT General, but it's just like... I don't know which moves are stab or not! <laughs> Remember! It's been forever, like, I don't even think I knew what stab moves were when I played Pokemon normally. I'm not a competitive Pokemon player. Nah, I was I wanted to use that, that quick attack, but I didn't go down far enough. <laughs> My worst nightmare. The menus. Ah, Slowpoke, huh? I can use Ivasaur again. And now I use Razor Leaf. What the hell, Givasaur? Apparently, Slowpoke couldn't even growl. It is the circus up in here. I mean, we already beat the Mr. Mime. But, oh wow, the circus back in town. Hey, Goblin, <laughs> get back. Well, let's try Striker, actually. If worse comes to worse, we can send the goblin in again. Sand attack. I hate you. We'll use two sand attacks on the Mr. Mime monster because I hate him. 1.5 damage boost on the same uh, moves as the Mon. Ah, that makes sense. But at the same time... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not going to have much luck because this guy is like, I've got a special attack defense. Yeah, I'm just going to use quick attack. Hmm. Just trying to use moves. Which one works? Of course you became confused. Fine. You are going to be subject to the goblin now. You have sealed your own fate. 
But it is good to know same type damage. Ah, same type attack. I guess that makes sense. But now, time for the goblin to crush the clown. See what I mean? Bye bye, clown. My goblin is Batman. Die already, Mr. Mime. Go back to France! Because France exists in Generation 1. Probably. About to send out Kadabra. Hmm. Ah, Kadabra on Kadabra fight. Let's go! Psybeam, for fun. My goblin will carry me to victory. And this Kadabra will annoy me. Why would you even want to use Recover when potions are there, you silly psychic silly man? Quit call! Finally, he used an attack! Good for you! I would have been very upset if it made my goblin confused at that. I never foresaw this! Of course you didn't. Ah, we're back here again. I think th it's telling me. Hey, go- Okay, I was wrong. Or maybe I was? No. Okay. Yes. I just mixed up which pads were what. And now I shall teleport to heal up my Pokemans. Because I'm fairly certain you can't teleport within buildings for some reason. Or maybe Giovanni in the gyms just really invested in anti-psychic measures. Maybe psychic Pokemon can't teleport out of lead-lined buildings. Fun fact, you can completely bypass the fourth gym and come back later. Yeah, I read about that, that, uh, basically you can do any gym after Misty. In any order you want, uh, barring, like, HM things. But that this one is very much more open than other Pokemon games. All right, we went through and fought all the ones in those squares. Let's fight this square. You and I, our Pokemon shall fight. Well, you're not wrong. So far, at least, psychic types haven't been as annoying as bell sprouts. <laughs> Wait. Your ghost type, I'm going to send out goblin because psychic is more powerful against ghost, I think? Die. Ghastly is up there on my I don't like list for one fact only. They paralyze with... Basically, yeah, they paralyze. During a run of yellow years ago, me and my brothers skipped it and were locked out of the Elite Four. We came back with a level 60 charge art and cleaned house. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. God dang it, I missed who... Uh... I'll look at my delay. It's gonna use Ghastly, okay. That's one good thing about streaming. I can look at my stream delay and it's just like, what did I miss? <laughs> He's about to use Haunter. Yep, I'm just gonna let Goblin clear house. Because I've learned from my mistakes of trying to spread the experience around. Though I guess that could be a thing where I could maybe try and go... Eh. I want the experience share. Fight me. I'll kill you all. Kill your family. Saffron Jim is famous for its psychics. You want to see Sabrina? I can tell. I refuse to lose to Mr. Ballman. Oh no, it's a slow bro. I'm gonna send out my Ivasaur and eat your soul. Please don't kill him. 
Ah, that's good. Hopefully you don't, he doesn't get a crit next round. Well, he is the slow bro, so maybe he's not that fast. So, maybe I'll get lucky. Oh boy, that was a critical hit. Mm. Aha, you fool! Grass should be a special attack, I think. It would be weird if grass was physical, but this is Generation 1. What the hell do I know? Criticals for days! Critical hit edition. You already checked out the fighting dojo in the north of Saffron? Yep, I beat that before I did the Lavender Town Tower. Once again, Goblin cleared house! <laughs> Sabrina is younger than I, but I respect her. Though it is kind of funny, it's just like, here, have a fighting type that's unique and interesting. It's like, yeah, it is unique and interesting. And now, <laughs> you can't use it to the gym that's right across the street. Because <laughs> it'll just get destroyed. Hey, I actually did decent damage. Now die. <laughs> yeah, just... Goblin will carry me to victory. I want to level up my other Pokemon, but unless it's type advantage, and even then, I've learned my lesson. Poor Charmeleon is not getting... going to fight that many grass types. Not good enough! I think I already fought you. Yeah, so let's go back. Pokemon take on the appearance of their trainers. Your Pokemon must be tough then. Ah, a compliment for the first time. Most of the time they're just mean. Hmm. Wait, normal wouldn't hit. Let's try flying. Of course. Apparently you want to die to the goblin. Fine. You'll get goblined. Probably should have healed him outside of battle. Please don't crit. Then again, it's because of the level. It might... I'm going to heal because I am coward. <laughs> It didn't affect you, fool. You angered me. Face psychic power! Goblin is just going to carry me. <laughs> I knew it! You are tough because of your Pokemon. Ah, huh. well, that was easy. I'm gonna save before I fight and heal up my Pokemon. I guess, uh... Well, I'm, I'm not gonna have many opportunities to use... Full heals anywhere else, so hey, wake up, sleepyhead. Even though, really, it doesn't really that matter that much. Hmm... Yeah, Goblin, I'll just throw Goblin in front. It's just like, default to Goblin. I had a vision of your arrival. I have had psychic powers since I was a child. I first learned to bend spoons with my mind. I dislike fighting, but if you wish, I will show you my powers. The question is, why do you have a whip? The second question is... Level 50, Abro, why? Confusion. Try and confuse it. I'm scared. Why is it such a high level? Alright, fine. Let's try and use Psychic. Obliterate this level 50 Abomination Abra. Accuracy fell because he's mean. Quit trying to flash. My poor goblin. Ah, he came confused, and now you're using the X defend against a special attacks.
These AI make no sense. Are you gonna hit yourself? Of course you won't. Stop flashing my goblin! Stop flashing my goblin! Um, did you beat Koga yet? Because he's the fifth leader. Sabrina's the sixth. Ah, that would explain it. I'm still gonna try and beat her. Goblin will carry me to victory! Hmm. Let's see how Striker does against this. Probably like level 50. Yep. Ouch, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure he's fine. Double team. That's why I saved. It's kind of weird that Sabrina's so much high level compared to the other Pokemon trainers in her gym. Doesn't make much sense to me. But that does explain why she's so much high le uh, higher of a level. It's because she's not meant to be fought yet. Even though she kind of lines up. Because, I mean, you'd go... You have to go, kind of, go through here. Well, at least that's how it went for me. I went and got the diddly dee, the water from the place. It's like, I can finally go through the guard. Went through the guard. So I came here, and then it's just like, oh yeah, the Sylph Scope stuff. And so that kind of made me want to come back here after beating the... Uh, that's the wrong move. God dang it. Slippery fingers. And of course you're going to use Recover, because you're a jerk. I'll make you confused, maybe. Because from the way I play the game, I would think that this is how the the level order. But it makes sense, maybe. Because you do get the polka flute first. So maybe they kind of expect you to follow the polka flute. <laughs> yeah, you run through Saffron a bit before you actually stay in there. So it just kind of makes you feel, Oh, I'll come back here, deal with Team Rocket. But I guess it does make sense because you do get the polka flute, but then they both open up at the same time. Mm. Make him confused. Make him confused. Fine, we'll use Psybeam. Keeps lowering my special as well. Which is just the most rude thing. Which is why I have hyper potions. So Psy Wave isn't a psychic attack. Or else it would have been like, oh, that's not effective. Or is it one of those weird ones where it's even though it's, uh, one, it bypasses. I think I read about that in weirdness. And quit lowering my special! I'm not even gonna have enough PP to do this. Especially because I keep missing. Hmm. Yeah, because the, the, the one thing that I find annoying is that she's so much more high level compared to the rest of the Pokemon trainers here, which I don't think is the norm. Hell, if I recall, Misty had... <laughs> one of Misty's Pokemon was lower level than the uh, Goldeen you fight before you fight Misty. So it's just like, what? <laughs> Why? And I would understand her being like, I don't know, maybe five, ten-ish levels more, but 
This is ridiculous. Quit affecting my accuracy. And quit healing. At this point, I might as well just restart and go to my save. That's just kind of annoying. <laughs> I guess that's the price of the open-endedness of Pokemon Yellow, Blue, and Red. But yeah, it's just kind of shocking that she's such a higher level compared to everyone else here. I thought that was kind of the point of the, like, the gym trainers. They're like, oh, can you fight this trainer, this gym leader yet? Meant to be like your litmus test. But okie dokie. We can go to Koga. I guess first we'll go... beat up Snorlax and capture him. Wait, uh, is my Pokemon okay? Yeah, they're decent enough. We're gonna put on my bicycle, and I want to ride my bicycle. We will head, capture... Ooh! We'll capture Snorlax, maybe capture some fish as well, fish Pokemon. Why? I don't know. Just to capture a few Pokemon. Or did I put away the old rod? Nope, I have it. It's a bite! And then I get back on my bicycle for the fight. I already got a magic carp. There's no reason to fight you, magic carp. Sideway does random 1 to 1.5 times user level damage and ignores resistances in Gen 1. Yeah, that makes sense. I guess I'll have to choose a different square that someone only bites. Or it could just be because I have the old rod and not another rod and you can only capture... Yeah, I think I remember that being the thing. Blee. Yeah, but I think the old rod is only good for Magikarp. Or at least that's what it feels like. In which case, if it isn't, then that's just bad... bad programming. Hello there. There's a lookout spot upstairs. My Pokemon ashes are stored in Pokemon Tower. You can have this TM. I don't need any more. You don't have room for this. I don't really care about teams that much anyway in this game. Especially because apparently, like, well, at least the, the gym leader TMs are weird. Alright, you gonna fight me, Mr. Fisherman? Yeah, I got a bite here. You mean me? <laughs> Old Rod is exclusive Magikarp. Well, that's just mean. I want to be able to capture more than just Magikarp. So when you get to, like, the first place where there's abundance of water, you're like, I'm gonna use it! And then you only get Magikarp. Now it's just disappointment. There should at least be one to two random Pokémon that you can get with the old rod. Just so, like, I don't know, have the people have fun. <laughs> Then again, there's probably not the... Then again, isn't water type like, uh... I forget. There might not be that many fish type Pokemon to have. Quit confusing my bird. Also annoying. How does the fish know peck? It doesn't have a beak. Sure, you can say it has a horn, but then horn attack already exists. 
Hey, Pikachu, annihilate this polywag. Could have, probably should have sent out Ivysaur to train him to. Hmm. Another Goldeen? Now Ivysaur can have this one. And Razor Leaf. <laughs> Razor Leaf just gets crits galore for some reason. <laughs> just a small fry. But I beat you. I am the victor. Be patient, fishiness waiting game. God, the nostalgia this has given me is wonderful. Happy that this can be of nostalgia givings. I forgot I needed to move around my Pokemon and then I didn't. Nah. Hey, Ivysaur. If I, wait. I think Tentacle is weird. I want to say, I forget where. I used a, a move that should have done, like, crit... Or not crit damage, but special damage to a Tentacool once, and it didn't do it, and I found it very odd. It's probably because of, like, I don't know, poison typing or something? Well, how dare you? I'm going to use Cut to finish you off. How does it feel? You died to an HM move. You are terrible. Bad. Bad Pokemon. And you can stay out to finish off the Goldeen. Vine Whip with a Fury. How dare you survive. Now, oh yeah, I forgot I, the reason I don't use you against Goldeen. Freaking Peck! Because you know Goldeen is the most bird-like Pokemon! That one got away! Ivasaur is evolving! Ah! He's a magical moment. I forgot to move my Pokemon again, God damn it! <laughs> It's just, when I'm like, oh yeah, a thing happened, and I'm like, now time to get a move on, then right next Pokemon battle, oh yeah. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> you know, thinking back on my time in the psychic gym, I'm probably the people that were the reason why future Pokemon games became so much more linear. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm allergic to confusion. Ah! Three times in a row. Why? At the very least, we haven't run into any bell sprout shenanigans this time around. Where it's just like the ultimate combo of you don't get to play today. Don't you just love it when you have a paralyzed Pokemon going up against a Bell Sprout? I probably could have just gone to the Pokemon Center, but my brain is fried right now. Please forgive me. Brain moving five million hours a mile. Yes, that is a way of telling time. Don't question it. I'd rather be working. Then why are you here? Fishy man wants to fight. Too bad I'm just going to murder him and his family. I will grot you with your own fishing wire. I don't think I've had a Razor Leaf not be crit. What is going on? The crits in this game are ridiculous. There is a reason why it is now dubbed Pokemon Critical Hit Edition. 
And I will also... Again, again, again. I get angry when I get crits sometimes. I probably should have swapped you out because, you know... Heck. The frickin' bird! Fish! What is with all the critical hits? What is this? The grass version of Karate Chop? Because I think it is. Except, oh wait, no, this would only be the grass version of Karate Chop if it was normal typing too! Still angry about that. At least they fix it in later games. <laughs> it's not easy. Being green. Dying to a child. And sure, I could go to Pokemon Center, but I don't want to. I want to go capture Snorlax, which means uh, once we get to Snorlax, I'll have to put up a... Ah, we're at Snorlax. Hello, Snor. I shall put War Turtle out first so that he can maybe bite you a bit. And then I can throw a Great Ball at you. A sleeping Pokemon blocks the way. I have to explicitly use the Poke Flute. Wake up, giant teddy bear man. And now it flies into a rage. <laughs> yep. I am Snorlax. You make me wake up. Me want to eat you. Bite his shin. Bite his shin again, but harder. Of course you used rest, you. Bubble beam! Bubble beam! Make it even slower! Force the bubbles down its throat! I hope it doesn't heal each... Okay, good. Oh, he's like, please don't heal each round. And now, before you have a chance, I'm gonna throw my great ball at you. Please capture. Nothing like soothing music to piss off a sleeping Pokemon. Yep. You are an annoying Pokemon. You know that, right? Because mm. I have, to, I should have saved. Mm. Quit sleeping! I woke you up already. Crit this time. Darn. I'm going to throw another great ball and pray to God. Hey! Huzzah! I forgot to read it, darn. Something about a little moldy, it never gets an upset stomach. And now. I should probably head back just so I can have my teleport localized at the Lavender Town Pokemon Center. Who designed this, I guess, bridge? Bridges? But it doesn't feel like bridges. Mm. Yeah, we'll go rest at Lavender Town. And, uh, see about grabbing some Pokemon that we don't have just yet, so that we can hopefully be ready for when we get the EXP share, which should be around Fachusia Gym. How do you even say that? It's Fachusia. It was not made for the American tongue! Is it Foo? Fa? Ch? Huh? S and then Sia. Sia is just like the one that makes the most sense out of all that, but they're just foo fa ch -hoo. What? Uh. Agony. I'll grab a few more. And I think I should have enough hyper potions to carry me. And I shall bicycle. Whee!
I can almost taste the EXP share. It'll be magical, although I think it's called the EXP All in this one. And it gives to everybody. <laughs> For some reason, I could have sworn that there was something about, like, modern Pokemon making EXP All be, a new, like, a new thing. I don't know. Electricity is in my specialty! How dare you. I have nothing to really do against electricity types. Ooh, let me guess. This one's going to explode in my face. I forgot that I had you out. Mm. Hey, Charmeleon, you want to try? Your hand at not dying? The first thing that happens is a screech in your ear. How do you even screech? You are a ball! What? I, I still want to know, I still want to know, what typing is that diddly dang move? Because I would think that it is a... At first I thought it was an electric type because I only see electric types use it, but then... I don't know, there was something that was like, oh, oh yeah, it affected Pikachu normally. Oh, it's probably one of those weird moves that defies type, like even though it's electric type or something, it does damage to electric types normally or something. Ah! Jin 1, why are you so weird? Oh boy, Electrode. If this is like any of the other Electrodes I've seen, it's probably just going to explode in my face. Yeah, it's just like, every single Electrode I've fought has just been like, I'm going to explode now, and then failed to kill my Pokemon. Only one explosion has killed my Pokemon, and it was the first one. Eh, yeah, you probably could. Yep, I knew it. At some point, either uh, fifth or sixth gym, XP share went from sharing with one Pokemon to the whole party. So they basically just went back in time. And nobody got that experience, because this guy's an <laughs> Oh, I was wondering why I wasn't moving. Hello, old man. Give me your rod. I'm the fishing guru's brother. I simply love fishing! Do you like fishing? Oh no! I had a gift for you, but you have no room for it. Ah, oh, well, works out. I was gonna teleport back to... Diddly dee da dee dee anyway. Why can I not teleport? This is it the magic of the fish, man? That's such a weird limitation. I guess it's just a blanket thing. If tile set says indoors, no t It's probably because teleport functions under fly rules, isn't it? <laughs> teleport is probably just under fly rules. But yeah, that is kind of funny that in the first generation, it's an experience all. Then for a few generations, it was specifically experience share, where one Pokemon gets a share of the experience. And then they decided to go back to experience all again. The evolution of Pokemon! I'm gonna fill up my backup. Well, I'm gonna throw in the old rod because it's freaking useless. I'm gonna keep the Poke Flute just in case. I don't need the card key anymore. At least I don't think so. Throw the TMs in, and the rare candy in. Quit putting me at the top, there are the things I want to put the at the bottom! And then I'll also put in the, <laughs> wait, bag full, store an item that, <laughs> yeah, get good rod, exactly. And then I'll put the Master Ball away and save that for Mewtwo, even though I think Mewtwo is post-game and there's not much to do post-game in the first game. Post-game in the first game. At least I don't think there is. Bicycle. We. Ooh, this also means that I might be able to catch more fish Pokemon for my Pokedex with this new rod. Every time I hear the music in this game, I'm just immediately hit with, Hey, you should really watch the anime and the anime movies again. And he's just like, yes, I really should. Do, 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 do. Give me the rod, old man. 
Give me the rod! Take this fish, young one. The super rod! Mewtwo is post-game. Yep, that's why. Because you have to beat, uh, become the champion, and then you can do things from the seas to the rivers. Go out and land the big one. I'll, then again, I won't really have need of you, will I, dear Super Rod? Because after I beat... Well, it depends. I, where do you get... Oh, oh, crap. I just remembered. I'm going to have to go through the Safari Zone. Not even a nibble. And the Safari Zone has certain items that I need, I think. I think an HM is in there. Uh, not even a nibble. Give me the fish. Oh, so all the magic carp were like attracted to that one rod, and they're just like, eh. Wait, if you have the master ball, where's your Lapras? In the uh, the uh, in Bill's PC. I went through Silphco and beat all them. Ah, horsey. War Turtle will bite you a little bit, and then you will be mine. I wonder if that'll be enough. It probably won't, but either way, great ball! Give up. Give up and be mine. Yes. If it senses any danger, it will vigorously spray water or a special type of ink from its mouth. Just gotta fish up some Pokemon. Just a little bit. Yeah, I just keep remembering more and more things, because, like, there's got a bunch of stuff to do in the Safari Zone. So that'll be interesting. Ah, another horsey. I know that I technically summoned you, but come on! And yes, Surf is an item tied to the Safari Zone. Which is kind of funny, you get... <laughs> The Super Rod, kind of before Fachusia, which holds the Safari Zone. And then you get Surf, which you don't... <laughs> which basically says, is a better Super Rod. Because then you can just randomly run into Pokemon without having to pull out an item. You do still have to go into your menu to activate it, but then it's a free roam. Nibble on my... Fishing rod, you Pokemon! It's gonna be another horsey, because of course it will. Darn, I'm just gonna run and go for the grass. The last one was Magikarp, and this one is horsey. Ah, but I shall now put Venusaur back in front to fight all the water types that we'll probably be running into. Oh, hey, we can fight this guy and take his Pokeball. Mwahahaha. Hello there. Were you trapped behind that shrubbery? You never know what you could catch! Behind a shrubbery? I'm the fish man. Kill that Magikarp. It's just sad. Yeah, it, it, Razor Leaf is just, like, hard-coded to be a freaking critical receptacle, I guess. Why? Critical again! My Venusaur just hates everything. Lost it! But what's this? I ran. Of course, that's going to Goblin, because he is the monster that will carry us to uh, Slay God. Wait, oh wait, Bleh, my brain is just going a million miles an hour. It's like, uh, have you found a moonstone? Yes, I have three in my PC. They were taking up room in my inventory. It is a small child. 
he must die. Alright. Hmm, who should fight you? Uh, we'll try Venusaur beating you up, and then we'll trade in someone else for probably the other Nido Ram. Because they come in pairs. Oh yeah, I forgot. Never mind, it's critical receptacle. It'll just annihilate you to death. Critical hits for days. Why? Yep. Oh, Nidorino! Hey, Striker, how about you have some fun? <laughs> First, we'll begin with Sand Attack. Throw sand in his eyes. <laughs> now, let's see how flying does against this guy. Let's try quick foot, see if there's any difference. Yeah, it kind of comes down to the same. How dare you kick my bird? Oh no, I think they're all going to be critical hits now because... Oh no. Huh. Oh, is that just for pin needle? Surfing has different encounters than the super rod. Yeah, that kind of makes sense because the super rod is just like... Uh, specifically, it has this level of Pokemon it can run into, whereas surfing... Is more like grass, so yeah, it makes sense. Ow! That has nothing to do with the moonstone you asked about, kid. How dare you? You hurt my feelings. That is why your Pokemon are now dead. Because you were not strong enough to keep them alive. Oh, hey, another thing? Grass! I can finally touch it! Apparently the grass wanted to touch me too. First step in. Aw, just a Pidgey. A level 28 Pidgey. This one just really didn't want to level up. Or, uh, did really didn't want to evolve. Oh yeah, I guess because flying is... I guess better. Yeah. Critical hits galore. Like, imagine my Venusaur going into a freaking fire gym and just being like, Hey, what's up? Razor Leaf. Everything dies. Fight me. Fight me. Maybe have interesting encounter of things that I have not caught yet. Fight me. Fight me. I think I scared them all off with that Razor Leaf. Yeah, they all, they all ran away. I had to really... Look for them. It's like Undertale Genocide Run. Abomination! So we meet again. It only sees fit that your fate should be tied to the PC system. I will tie you into the Matrix, you little. I hate you. I hate you. Into the Matrix you go. Die. Get epilepsy with Porygon. Now until forever, I will have that reaction to Bell Sprouts because of this game. Prefers hiding humid places because it's an asshole. It ensnares tiny insects with its vines and devours them because it's an asshole. You know your name. My hatred never dies. After the grass gym, that is my reaction to bell sprouts. Now unto eternity. <laughs> Hi, you want to fight? I found Carbos in a cave once. Good for you. Sent out Goldeen. Oh boy, time for murder. Ah, double murder. I forgot Pikachu was in lead. Critical hit Thunderbolt. 666 experience! The number of the beast. Come on, Striker! Pour sand into the water. Of 
course you would. Quit pouring water on my bird! Sand attack! You, 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 you were going to pull a Clefairy? Use my Clefairy, ta the Clefairy tactics on me? How dare you! How dare you! Now this bird will eat you, tadpole up! And will rip out the intestines that we see right there on your stomach, the swirly burly! Kill! For daring to try and hypnosisize us multiple times is... No, that's my job, because I'm the jerk. I don't even do that anymore, because I put my Clefairy into the box. And now Venusaur can eat. And uh, Crit Leaf. <gasps> it missed. What is this magic? Ah, well, we'll go again. But will it crit? It's the new Will It Blend! Will it crit? It will! I think I have seen Razor Leaf not crit once. A single time. It just messed up. Indeed, small child. My bird Pokemon want to scrap! Okay, weirdo. You have a Mohawk. Ah, it's Kadikaras. Wow, you're a... Terrible bird trainer. Your pigeon. How did my thunderbolt this? Mm. <laughs> He's unaffected. That was a productive turn. Why is there so many pidgeys that are higher leveled than their evolution point? Not evolved. Ah, Pidgeotto. We'll finally fight one of them. Now, burn it alive with thunder. Cook with electricity. I wonder if that changes the taste of food if you cook something with electricity. All your birds are dead. My bird combo lost? It's bird combo, there was two birds. I'm told I'm good for a kid. Well, we'll have to see if it stands to reason. Well, you have five Pokemon that's already going good for you, but it's a Pidgey and I have a Pikachu. You've already lost. Die. Bye bye. Wow, Meowth, huh? Who should we send out to have fun? Charmeleon, because he he has such a he's such a poor time. Poor Charmeleon. He, he, he only knows Ember because the world is pain and agony. They're growling at each other. I was going to leer. But then I did the thing again, where I only went one way. Because I'm impatient. And it's just going to keep growling and screeching and growling and screeching. It's just going to die before it can do anything. You are a very dumb cat. Bye-bye, Meowth. That's right! We'll have uh, Charmeleon out there beat up this one, too. Gra <laughs> it's gonna use Hyper Fang, and it's gonna do a lot of damage, because it's a jerk! Huh, it didn't crit. Yay, the world is kind! <laughs> For now. The world is kind for now. Yay, I got the crit. I win. Hmm. Pikachu can annihilate him. And then the Pidgey died. Now I, w I wonder if anybody's ever played through Pokemon, but they only used Pidgey. A team of six Pidgey, now and forever, marching to destruction. Alright, Growl. How dare you throw legal tinder at my... 
Oh, come on. You'll get flamethrower at 42 if you don't evolve at 36. Otherwise, you wait till uh, 36. And otherwise, you wait till 46. Huh. That's kind of weird, but good to know. So Charmeleon gets flame. Well, uh, yeah, Charmeleon gets. Fl or yeah, I assume because Charmeleon would level up kind of similar around the time of uh, Venusaur did. So I'll keep that in mind. That is the one weird thing about Pokemon, is some of them learn moves, sometimes exclusively if you don't evolve them. But that requires prior knowledge, because I don't think they ever tell you that in these games. Ah, oh, crap, I forgot. We're into a pseudo-maze. North to Silence Bridge. That's an ominous name. Silence Bridge. Ah, eh, fine, we'll teleport back, because I don't want to use that many. It'll just be a little annoying coming all the way back, but we did fight everyone already, so we'll cut down on time a little bit. And that's why I enjoy teleport. Alrighty then, Pikachu, what do you think of development so far? Pikachu is grandly happy with the slaughter. Oh, where's my bike? I ride my bike all over the place like they're corpses. Charmander actually learns Flamethrower 2 at 38. That's so weird. <laughs> Interesting, but kind of weird. And then just like, especially this early in the series, too. They already threw that in. And we're already back. Oh, now we gotta fight both of them. And they're blocking the way! Do you want to Pokemon with me? Go do the Macarena elsewhere, you monster! Oh boy, it's so cute. I just want to poke its little eyes out! We would always be Button Club Charmander until 38 and then just evolve him twice the next two levels. That makes sense. That is, that seems to be an efficient way of doing things. I just don't, didn't know that was a thing. About to send out Meowth? I shall beat him down with Striker! Pour sand into his eyes. The threat of sand was too much for the poor Meowth. Pokemon gets deep sometimes, because I don't know if I'm, like, uh, using attacks or, yeah, attacks to their fullest. Are they ones that you want to use multiple times to increase their effectiveness, or are they ones that are 100% right out the gate? That we absolutely hated the Charmeleon sprite. Yeah, Charmeleon is weird looking. Wow, it's so nice to actually fight Pokemon of a similar level to me. It's magical! Sure, I'll play with you. Just a ratata, huh? Drown it in bubbles! It drowned in bubbles. <laughs> well, this works out really well for me. Hello, Vulpix. Bye-bye, Vulpix.
And another round. Oh, well, we'll just let War Turtle win this out. It's almost like the game intended this route. I know, right? But come on, can you really blame me for being like, ah, oh, I went through this town. Team Rocket are beating up Sylphco. I'll have to come back here after I deal with, because I knew Sylphco was like related to Lavender Town, so I was going to come back and be dee dee bop dee boop dee And then it just turned out, oh, wait. There are other places you can go to. Wow, your badges are too cool. Too cool. Too cool. Silence fun. My war turtle will bite your polywag. How dare you. Why, why would you use water gun on the water Pokemon? Are you trying to erode his shell? You are a very dumb polywag. A. A button. A. A button. A. Wake up, you stupid turtle! After enduring a crit and having his speed fall, he finally woke up. Aha, you can't double slap this turtle. Bit, bit your hands off. That's why you don't have any in your sprite. The war turtle ate the sprite's hands. Yeah, we'll send out Venusaur. Have him have some fun. I can't talk too much. We were convinced that Bulbasaur was a post-game grab and never put together that it was based on Pikachu's happiness. Hmm, can't talk too much. We were con we were convinced that Bulbasaur was a post-game grab and never put together that it was based on Pikachu's happiness. Hmm. Yeah, Pokemon is full of oddities and secrets, so <laughs> some or just information that isn't all that clear. <laughs> Not enough. I'll just fight everyone. Fight everyone. My cute Pokemon wish to make your acquaintance. For a moment there, I thought she was gonna say, "My cute Pokemon want to make your Pokemon die." Or something along those lines. I mean, they say kill, blood, and death throughout this entire thing, so... Lavender Town exists, man. And then the Pidgey died. And everyone rejoiced! <laughs> and now I shall send out Striker to beat up the cat. Sand attack in his eyes. Now we can steal all his money. Coins scattered everywhere. We also left a Pokemon in the daycare. I think Eredita and actually couldn't afford to get him back. Yeah, that sounds like daycare, all right. You want your Pokemon back? Too bad. It'll be five billion Poke Dollars to get it back. I forgot that's not where Thunderbolt is. But at least we'll get a critical Thunderbolt. Pidgeotto. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just annihilate him. You think you're safe? You're not. Die. Bye bye, birdie. <laughs> I defeated the traitor. Wow, you totally won. And then I stole all of your your poor Pokemon's earnings. Nope, we can't even select that rock. Profound sadness! Oh. Trainer tips! You select to switch items in the win item menu. You 
can do that? Hmm. I did not know. I guess if you just want to come in here and fight Pokemon. Ah, the abomination. If I had a Pokemon out that could annihilate you, I would, but I will settle for going away. Ah, a vile... No, uh, no, not vile plume. We haven't run into one of those yet, but a gloom. You will be a nice addition to my collection. Yeah, you better not fucking stun my, my boy. Ah, oh, well, this works all the same, I guess. Great ball, make this Pokemon mine. Ah. You dare deny me! Why would you say he's already asleep, don't you know? Sleeping people can't be stunned. The... Well, I guess stun spore is paralyzed. Param oh, yeah, he's sleeping people can't be perceived. Uh, paralyzed. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. Stay in the ball! Finally! Let's see what the Pokédex has to say about Gloom. Smells incredibly foul. However, around one out of 1,000 people enjoy sniffing its nose-bending stink. <laughs> to the PC you go, into the Matrix! How did he not try and kill me? We shall switch Charmeleon in so that he can wake up. No! I should have made him come towards me, but I did not! I am a failure! Too fast, too furious. How dare you leer at my sleeping Pokémon! How could you mirror my move? I did not make a move! Now you will die! Quit leering at my Pokemon! They don't know what to think! He's about to send out Pidgey, we'll have him continue on his rampage of murdering the Pokemons. Wow, you're a little abomination, aren't you? Throwing pocket sand in my Charmeleon's eyes! He'll heat up the... Uh, well, that's just cruel, because now the sand in his eyes, and when he uses a fire attack, he'll probably heat up enough to melt the sand, so he'll have molten sand in his eyes. How can you do that, you little monster? <laughs> Keep him coming. Keep the buffet coming. Feed my boy. Okay, now the sand's finally getting into his eyes. Because it's just like hitting scratch, hitting scratch. Yep, the, the, the sand attack is finally caught up. Caught up to my boy. It's far too late for that. Bye-bye, Spiro. What? How dare you? The growl actually saved him. Oh. Come on, one more scratch. Yeah, and now you get to rest. Good boy, Charmedian. Pat Pat. We shall swap up to my boy, Pikachu, who longs for the blood of innocence. Thunderbolt. Bye bye, Spiro. That Spiro probably came out. I can finish off that Charmeleon. No, you can't. Eh, yeah, just fight the dude. What are you looking at? Uh, somebody I probably should have swapped my Charmeleon out for somebody else before I started fighting him. Oh, he's a biker. How, wait, how'd you get your bike here? I guess the same way I got my bike here, but still. How dare you. Uh, 
I guess I'll use War Turtle? Because I don't want to... <laughs> I already leveled up Goblin enough. Let's let some other Pokemon have some fun. Probably. Goblin is already fed and ready for murder. He does not need more. Bye bye, coffee. Ah, that works. Trying to learn Slash. Is Slash any good? Because I have no idea. It's just like, to me, it's like Scratch and Slash. Like, maybe it's a better Scratch? But I don't know. It's, like, just imagine being a kid back in, like, 1998, playing this for the first time, and just, like, throwing these moves at you. You have no idea what they do. You have no idea if one move's better than another. It's just, like, move. And you're like, what even is this? Ah, eh, screw it. I'm gonna replace Scratch. Mm. Do I want to replace Scratch? I can only assume it's a better alternative, but Pokemon's weird. It's the first generation, man. Slash hits harder with higher crit rate. Bye-bye, Scratch. <laughs> Thank you, BLT General, for the advice. And I'm keeping the... Growl and Leer because they are quite nice to have. Oh no. The toxic balloon is tackling my poor turtle. He's just toxic balloon after toxic balloon. I guess it makes sense. It's a biker fighting me. Does he just, like, hook up his coughing to his motorcycle so they take the toxic fumes in and use it for attacks? That's Pokemon, baby. Ah, PSN. PlayStation exists. Dang, stripped gears! Well, that's going to exist. Hello there, person. Want to fight? My bird Pokemon should be ready for battle. And I just put Venusaur in. Poor Boar. Poor Boar. Well, we have the always crit li Razor Leaf, so screw it. <laughs> you don't scare me, Pidgey. I have Razor Leaf. That means I win. See? <laughs> it's not very effective. It killed it in one hit, but it's not very effective. <laughs> Go, Razor Leaf! <laughs> Will this be the one? Will it crit? It crits again! <laughs> Ah, but will it happen again a third time? Three in a row. Three, three, three. Will it go for three? Razor Leaf. Will it crit this time? It's another Pidgey. It's not re It's resistant to it. But will it crit and kill the Pidgey? It is a crit. Now, can this be a whole party wipe? But four birds going up against one plant Pokemon. Will it? Oh, it's a big scary boy. But will it survive another Razor Leaf? It's not. It's resistant to it. But can it survive? a crit. Will it crit? It crit and it survived! Congratulations, Firo! You finally did it! You did what your brothers and sisters could not. You survived! And you're going in hard with that Fury attack. We haven't seen that since uh, the bugs. The bug, 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 the bee, the bee man. Bee Billsburg. Just madness. Madness! Madness. Stab boost plus high crit rate equals power play. <laughs> yep. But it's just the fact that it crits every single time. My eyes. My eyes. My eyes. Ow. Ow. I want to fight that guy up there. Sorry, war -y. war turtle. Fight me. You need to use teams to teach good moves to Pokemon. 
not really. Most of the TMs I have had have been not worth it. Oh boy, another Pidgey. Let's see if it can survive. Jesus, four straight crits. Like I said. <laughs> or is that uh, for Fury Attack? I wasn't paying attention to Fury Attack. Oh, hey, holy crap. He's missing all over the place. Will it be a crit? Will it be a crit? Because this thing crits all the time. A critical hit, but it survived. Good job. Have a vine whip. <laughs> There's another critical hit. Ah! Oh, yeah, and by the way, I have, uh, in the early game, I experienced Karate Chop. I think every, like, 9 out of 10 Karate Chops hit and crit. I hate <laughs> I even made the joke that it's just like, there's a reason why Karate Chop is normal type in this game, and it's because the person who liked uh, using it over and over again didn't want it to be resistant against other types, so it's just like, ah, it'll be normal and do crit damage. God, I remember the poison flash of pain. Use your full heal if you got it, but I think Fichuzi is just dead. Yeah, that's why I'm like, letting my war turtle suffer a little bit, because Fichuzi is just like right around the corner. Oh boy, Fury Attack. Oh boy, Fury Attack. Oh boy, Fury Attack. Well, this one makes extra sense because there's two beaks coming at you. We shall let Pikachu devour this soul. It's still impressive that they bit crushed Pikachu so well. It's like that it's like that one commercial where all the Pokemon get crushed in a in a trash compactor. They get crushed. Do I even have full heal? I should probably use it since it's a little way and I'm not gonna use full heals that much. Or do I have a full heal? Yeah, we have a full heal. Might as well. Probably should have done it earlier, but oh well. You are now safe, my child. Hello there. TMs are on sale on Celadon, but only a few people have HMs. That's me. I'm people. Bird Keeper wants to fight. Fight. Razor Leaf! But will you survive? Bad, eh, decently. <laughs> Whirlwind. I think that's a TM move. Why would you teach it? It's so useless. Yet another crit. Like I said, I think I've only ever seen it miss. Or not miss, but it not crit once. Uh, a Fero, I see. I have a Thunderbolt with your name on it. <laughs> bye bye, Mr. Birdman. I think from this point on, Pikachu has their own unique cry and, ho uh, and none of the monster cries like the other Pokemons. Yep, I do believe so. Let's go this way. Hello? You want to fight? Have you taught your bird Pokemon how to fly? No, because I haven't gotten it yet. But I also want to. Are you going to give it to me if I whoop your ass? Little man with a mohawk. But yeah, as for uh, Pikachu, I'm unsure if it keeps its cries in, like, the GBA games, but I know that later on, uh, the 3D games, at the very least, have it cry, uh, its anime name. Pikachu, the ultimate weeb. And then, like, Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee also did the same thing for Eevee, I think. Bye-bye, doo-doo-oh. 
Huh, who should have a chance at this? War Turtle, you got poisoned and suffered quite a bit. Kill this bird, drown it in bubbles. Bubbles it and drown. Haha, <laughs> it growl. How could a bird growl? It's a bird. Now that just makes no sense whatsoever. There's something wrong with that bird. So it can spit bubbles. It can growl. That's not a bird. That's a dragon. Yeah, it's a level to the hub. Bye bye, bird keeper. Your face is ugly. Shut down in flames. Give me fly. No fly. You bitch. Route 14, west of Chuzu City. It never ends. It never ends. We ride out here because there's more room. Then why'd you stop to fight me? Oh no, it's an ugly bastard. I have no idea who does it. Have. Screw it, I'm just gonna send out goblins so goblin can have one, some fun. It's been a while. Goblin, eat this man. Oh no, not the toxic balloon. Eat. He's about to use muck. Muck! 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 Ugly boy. Kill muck with a bubble bean. Don't put my war turtle in a wheelchair. They have to do Ginyu Force poses for the team. Poison, yo. You poisoned my boy again! How very rude. They poisoned my baby boy! Have you heard of the legendary Pokemon? Yeah, we could have gone to the power plant, but we don't have Surf yet. Huh. So this is where this abomination comes in. Hey Pikachu, wanna eat some nice, rare Pokemon? For some reason I thought that he was a Generation 2 Pokemon. Why do I feel like he was a Generation 2 Pokemon? My memory is getting Mandela'd. Bye bye. Why? Why'd I lose? You only have one Pokemon. The three legendary Pokemon are all birds of prey. That's why he cares. I'm not into it, but okay, let's go. If you're not into it, why did you approach me and engage? I keep forgetting I should probably move my boy out of first place. Razor Leaf! Get another crit, my boy! Because I just find it hilarious. <laughs> He's about to use Fero. Oh no. Pikachu, kill it. <laughs> Man, I would hate... I would both love and hate to live in a real Pokemon world. Mainly because the bugs are so big. So big and terrifying. And horrific. I knew it! I think the Jersey City is right that way. I think I am going... Because for some reason my brain is just like, Brain Blast! Memory from the past! Oh! Don't worry, people. We'll be right back to fight you all. It's just that I want to kill my Pokemon. TM20, what's that? Fly? Since it was mentioned, so they were just going on about TMs and fly. Rage! 
Oh, hey, it's that move I made Charmeleon not use, uh, learn. Are you working on a Pokedex? Professor Xig came by here. This is probably the all, but I can't do it yet, because I need to catch more Pokemon. Remember me? I'm Professor Oxade. If you caught 50 kinds of Pokemon, I'm supposed to give you an XP all. Have you caught at least 50 kinds? Yes, Wink. Uh-oh, you have caught only 31 kinds of Pokemon. You need 50 kinds of XP all. Yep, I need to catch 20 more Pokemon. Yeah. Hello, old man. Safari Zone has a zoo in front of the entrance. Out back is the Safari game for catching Pokemon. Where is the... Where is the Barbie? So we can put shrimp on it. I stand corrected. Pikachu goes back to regular Monster Cries until Kalos in Generation 6. That's about what I thought. Name, Lapras, a.k.a. the King of the Seas. Ah, that actually added it to my Pokedex. I think. Where is it? Where is the... Well, there's the Pokemart. Well, we left. That's not good. I need to put on my bike so I can go faster. I need to put on my Go Fasters. Where's the Pokemon... There's the gym. Well, it's right next to the gym. Safari Zone's warden is old, but still active. All his teeth are false, though. Ew. Bill files his own Pokemon data on his PC. Did he show you? I turned him back into a human. Hmm, you've met Bill? He's my grandson. He always liked collecting things, even as a child. Poor Turtle is dead. <laughs> right here. Dead in time for healing. But I'll heal everyone and go and fight all the other people so I can level up some. But let's talk to all the people here. You can't win with just one strong Pokemon. It's tough, but you have to raise them all evenly. If you're studying Pokemon, visit the Safari Zone. It has all sorts of rare Pokemon. There's a narrow trail west of Viridian City. It goes to the League HQ. The HQ governs all trainers. Safari Zone Warden's home. We have to get him his teeth. I remember that after they mentioned his, like, gold teeth. I was like, oh yeah, we have to get those for him. Tell that to my Emerald Run. <laughs> yeah, for the one strong Pokemon thing. Is he going to be a new Pokemon? It's an Oddish! Hmm, use Cut on it. We'll, we'll whittle it down a bit. I think that's enough. And now... Great Ball. Please don't resist too much, you little plant you. Good little Oddish, come home. It may be mistaken for a clump of weeds. If you try to yank it out of the ground, it shrieks horribly. I need to remember the Pokemon I have caught. Well, the rare, the rare, the damn it. Level 100 Sceptile and all mid level 50s for the rest. <laughs> I can see that. Want to play po with my Pokemon? And by play with my Pokemon, I mean want them to try and kill you. Abomination! Monster, die! Damn it. I guess it probably ha also has a resistance to its own time. I could probably see a reverse stab. Pokemon Metal Edition. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Charmeleon, maybe try and burn. Of course.
course you would, because you're a little monster. You want to see my Charmeleon struggle. Ripping Hottish out of the ground and apart. Kill the bell sprout. I subjured them. Oh, yay, it burned. Ha 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 ha. Make it suffer. Make it suffer. Oh, sure, now that you have acid, you're using it all over the place. But I remember. I remember when you used rap over and over and over. No mercy for the bell sprout. Burn them all. Burn them all! Silly Oddish, my Charmeleon can't get hooked on acid. He's already paralyzed. Why is my Charmeleon so slow? Ah, it's fully paralyzed. Mmm. Send out Tangla, huh? Pikachu, I think you might be decent here. Kill. <laughs> Pikachu, use kill. That's actually resistant. Interesting. If this is the virtual console, there's a mini game you can play near the Fatruzia Beach. Nope, this is not the virtual console one, but that is interesting that they added it. Huh. Man, my Pikachu is weak. So go Striker, I guess. How dare you try to absorb from my darling bird! Use wing attack! It was so super effective, it didn't do that much. Yeah, my boy leveled up! I was too impatient. And that is why you will die. Your impatience will be the death of you. Any last minute Pokemon want to fight? No, no, they're just all over here. They all migrated to the next patch. Ah, a Venonat, huh? I hope this vine... Oh, I'll, mm, I'll use cut. Otherwise, you had to connect with the Coliseum copy and get special Pikachu of Surf. Ah! Interesting. Go, Great Ball! Add Vino. Pokemon Box is full? What do you mean, Pokemon Box is full? That is annoying. That is very annoying. Fine, put it out of its misery. We'll go back to the... I am being frustrated. Ah, this is where all the annoyances come in. Mm. Kill the Venonat! Kill the Venonat! Monstrous existence. The box is full? I've never seen that. I have no idea what it's talking about. First generation is weird. We'll get on my little bicycle. I want to ride my bicycle back to the Pokemon Center so I can find out what the hell is going on. Looks like I'm going to have to either change the box or throw out some Pokemon. But let's see. Oh no, that's the gym. I don't want to go to the gym. I want to go to the Pokemon Center.
and right when I had a Vinonat ripe for capture. All right. <laughs> Let's see which Pokemon we must obliterate. Oh, we have to change box. Well, that's aggravating. Why is that a thing? <laughs> ah, first generation Pokemon. Trying my patience. We'll cut our way through. Buy some more Pokeballs. To the Pokemart. I think Great Balls are actually better in mo some situations, so I'll take some of you. And some of you. Wow, I've never done that before. Welcome to Generation 1 Pokemon, where I'm just stumbling across all of the little weird bits of the game. Like, I'm sure that a lot of people know that these exist, but they're just like, oh yeah, it's just a small quirk. <laughs> and then, yeah, then I get to experience it for the first time. <laughs> like, it's probably because I never caught that many Pokemon when I was a kid. I just got my six and used them for the most part, unless I came across one Pokemon that was interesting. Then I'm just like, oh, hey, Pokemon, that's interesting. Be mine. Granted, when we played Yellow, we could always try to play as Ash and only catch his team. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense. Not you, abomination. We already caught you and sent you to hell. We require another Vinonat. I'll put on my bicycle so I can go super fast. I want to ride my bicycle. <laughs> Come out and play! Another abomination! We're done with you already. Be gone, Satan! We have things to do. Many much important things to do. Like catching a Vinonat. We know that it is here. And it will... Will you kindly go away? Abominable grass. It is haunting me, it seems. Go away. I want to catch a Vinonet. I want to catch a Vinonet. I want to catch a Vinonet. I want to catch a... Well, you are a suitable replacement, I suppose. Use cut. You can't poison him! He's already a salad! Alright then. Great Ball, go, and if I swear you break out, someone really will be a salad! When hungry, it will swallow anything that moves. Hapless prey is melted inside by strong acids. When I whistle, I can summon bird Pokemon. When I whistle, I can drill into your head. How adorable. Venusaur, cut it into fillets. How cute you survived. <laughs> Even the cut got a critical hit. Amusing. Well, looks like it's a smoggish board for Pikachu up in here. Thunderbolt.
<laughs> so many bird keepers, all willing to feed Pikachu here. And he started with a Pidgeotto and moved on to a Pidgey. You make no sense, Birdman. You make no sense. Ow, that's tragic. But there's still a Venonat hiding in here. And yet another Pokemon that can be added to my collection. My lovely collection to try and get me an experience all. With an experience all, my journey can be greatly aided. Let's see what it says. Its large eyes act as radars. In a bright place, you can see that they are clusters of many tiny eyes. My god, that's disturbing. And I think that'll be pretty much most of the Pokemon in here. Uh, my birds are shivering. You're good, aren't you? Ah... Dodrio, huh? Will you survive a razor leaf? Oh boy, more fury attack, but this time it has another beak to use. It only hit <laughs> How fitting. Three beaks, three hits. Good old reliable razor leaf with its critical hits. One, one, one! And of course, we shall throw out our darling Pikachu so he can have more fun slaughtering the birds. About to use to duo. I shall not change. <laughs> Just as I thought. We will go through one by one. West of Atrusia City. We'll play around with these, see if there's any Pokemon over here, but I think we got. Pretty much all. We already caught a gloom. So Bell Sprouts, Glooms, Venonats. I think that's all in these woods. Yeah, just time to beat up the remaining trainers and we'll be done with this part. And we'll go catch some Pokemon in the diddle do Iris Pokemon because I live alone. Mood. We'll go to the Safari Zone, try things out there, catch some Pokemon while also looking for uh, the teeth and the HM and stuff. I'll throw out Charmeleon so he can get poisoned. Haha, you thought you were vine whipping a grass type, but it was me, a fire type. Ah, you almost made it. Sending out an ivy saw. Good for you. Your leech seed can only do so much. Slash attack. 
Woot woot! I didn't ask for this. You challenged me. Let me try out the Pokemon I just caught in a trade. Good for you. Soon they will die. So which one is it? Oh boy, a gloom. How adorable. It didn't affect, but that just means it missed for some reason. He's about to use Oddish. Won't change. Let's see what Slash does on its own. Almost murder. Of course you would poison my beloved baby boy. Oh, I didn't even mean to do that, but I did. Oh well. I'm just pressing A, pressing A, and then I lose track. I just disassociate as my Pokemon slaughter. Silly, he's already hooked on acid. That's why he's poisoned, or has a PSN account. Oh no, Charmeleon's trying to defect to Sony! Not good enough! Or maybe they are good enough in that you are just failing them as a trailer, a trainer. Hmm, ever heard of that? Now I have to go heal my Pokemon again? Oh wait, what am I doing? I have teleport. I'm dumb. Goblin has just been at the back of my mind so much that <laughs> it did not it. I keep forgetting I have teleport. And I can use it. Uh, Cuz I was going to comment, man, they sure are mean by the fact that you have to go all the way around town to get into the Pokémon Center and there's like, "Oh wait, I can teleport." Not when inside buildings, but I can teleport. So let's see. If we caught, we had 31 before. We caught Venonat, Weeping Bell. I think that's it. So now we need... I don't even know. I hate math! Fork over all your cash when you lose to me, kid! Wow, it looks like you're going to have to... Well, well, well. I'm going to have lots of money in a minute. Don't poison my baby boy! God damn it! This is why I have teleport. To make this slightly more bearable. Oh, you gonna send out grime, or will you? Mm, I'm gonna slash the grime. I love you, kitchen gun. To slash the grime, the balloons, and rhyme. Oh boy, it's poison balloon, but with an odd face attached. It's a tumor. He's already on PlayStation Plus. He doesn't need another account. Yeah, that's a lot of experience. That can't be true. He only gave me five dollars. What an asshole. But we'll teleport again because I want to level up my boy. And I also don't want him to be poisoned while we're out here. Do, 
And now I must flee. Flee into the night. A part of me wonders why uh, Nintendo has never made, or a Game Freak or whoever, that the they've never made a Team Rocket Pokemon game. Because you'd think a lot of people would love that, but then you also have to remember that, like, they're probably not doing it because they don't want the moral guardians to be like, Gas, they want children to steal pets. Even though that's Peter's job. <laughs> oh yeah, we already caught one of you too, so we don't need you. So we have... We need 15 more Pokemon-ish. Yeah. Fight me. Hey kid, come on, I just got these! Your rim? Wow, you have a full team. But my Charmeleon will burn away your pathetic team. Oh boy, he's gonna get poisoned again. Oh hey, he didn't get poisoned. It's a miracle, Billy! It's so magical he didn't get poisoned. Uh, let's see, who do we want to... Uh... Uh, War Turtle could use some leveling. Use Bubble Beam. Please don't get poisoned. Bubble Beam, the smog away. Oh no, it's the tumor monster! <laughs> the original Dudoo. It's not a bird, but it has two heads. Like, you have to wonder what it's like, like, in-universe. To be going along, and then you just fight tons of poison type trainers. And you're just like, God dang it, I don't want to spend all my money on antidotes. And then you realize that in the Pokemon world, there's probably a conspiracy theory that all poison type users are in the big Pokemart, uh, uh, pocket. Where they work for Pokemart to make people buy more antidotes. Probably born out of a want to compete with the Pokemon sinners. Why not? Why not what? What is wrong with you people? And then I'll put War Turtle in first so that they can level up a bit as I beat up all the trainers that are in my way. No, not, not, not the goblin, no. Hmm. It is getting a bit late, so I think I shall head into the safari zone. Now. Because I probably have lots of things that just be nice. We'll talk to people. Look at these. Ooh, Eric, where's Sarah? I said I'd meet her here. He has a name. It's a miracle. Name. Slowpoke. Friendly and slow moving. We'll s slash behind. And then head into the safari zone. Huh, I wonder what that building is. The item ball in there is really a Pokemon. Then what building is this? I should have read. I'm be dumb.
We nicknamed the Warden Slowpoke. He and Slowpoke both look vacant. Slowpoke is very knowledgeable about Pokemon. He even has some fossils of rare extinct Pokemon. Slowpoke came in, but I couldn't understand him. I think he's got a speech problem. You're all very rude. Aren't you? He just needs his gold teeth. How do the normal people get by if they don't have cut? I shall save just because... Oh, I need 16 from the looks of it. Hi, is it your first time here? Sure. Safari has four zones in it. Each zone has different kinds of Pokemon. Use Safari Bars to catch them. When you run out of time or Safari Balls, it's game over for you. Before you go, open an unused Pokemon box so there's room for new Pokemon. That'd be nice to know. Welcome to the Safari Zone. For just 500, catch all the Pokemon you want in the park. Would you like to do it? Sure. We only use special Pokemon Ball here. 30. We'll call you the PA when the uh, run out of time or Safari Balls. Gotta catch as many Pokemon as possible. You should count as a new one. Go ball! Or is the types count? Darn you. Of course it ran away. Be mine! I wonder if there's a strategy to the Safari Zone. Alright, Paris was caught. Burrows under the ground to gnaw on tree roots. The mushrooms on its back absorb most of the nutrition. But it's interesting that they actually tell you about the boxes when you get to the safari zone. Yeah, I already have you. Trainer tips. Press the start button to check remaining time. Huh, that's a thing. Rest house. Well, let's see. I'm catching Pokemon to take home as gifts. Where did my boyfriend Eric go? It counts in here? That's rude. Do you need... Well, uh, nah, 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 nah. Do you need Surf to get some things? That would be kind of rude if you need Surf to get... The gold teeth. Hopefully it's just a Pokemon type thing. Hey. The heads attract each other and spin around. There must be six heads for it to maintain balance. Let's see if there are any interesting Pokemon that can be caught here. Super Rod, go! Not even a nibble. I wonder if that's because of Safari Zone or just because no nibble. Aha, we got a thing! <gasps> Dratini! Or no, not Dratini. Dragonair! Ball! Please don't run away. I missed. Ball! How did I miss again? Ball! What the hell? That's super weird. Oont annoying. Center area. Already have one of you. I wonder if the... Like, if Generation 1 was taken into consideration... Like, uh, later on, if this place would be considered like a... Pokemon Ranger Reserve. You will be a decent test to see if it's like, uh, if evolutions count as Torch type, but you ran away because you're a jerk. Oh, hey, Pokeball. Give item. Max Potion. How oddly useless. Oh, Pokeball. Mm -hmm. TM37. What the hell's TM37?
Egg Bomb. Yeah, Surf and Super Rod should allow it to catch Dratini in Dragonair. And fascinate, I've never noticed that the Safari tune is the evolution music. Yeah. No, that's not me. It's gonna get caught, isn't it? Good. Now run away. Let's try and catch another Dragonair here. Come to me, Dragonair! Be my friend. Oh, screw you! Come to me, Pokemon that I do not already have. Ah, this must be the Magikarp Lake. Got it. Full restore. But what if I don't want to full restore? Ah. It's a trap to waste your time. <laughs> and there is no time limit. They actually refer to step count. Yeah, that I know. That's why I commented, oh, it, uh, the timer is happening in here when I was walking around the rest house. Alright, this is a big waste area. <laughs> wow, this is just a big waste turnaround. Interesting. That's like where a rare Pokemon would appear. Because it's a big empty place. <laughs> Maybe we can try that test again. Would you like to come with me, Cubon? Don. Come with me, Cubon! Yay! Where's the skull of its deceased mother? Its cries echo inside the skull and come out as a sad melody. Area 2. Let's try again. Maybe this place won't have Magikarp coming at me. Or maybe I just got lucky with the Dragonair. Not even a nipple. Go, Super Rod! The path to the Warden's Teeth is pretty long from what I remember. It's like 60 to 75% of your steps to get there. Yeah, that's what I figured. Oh, I, I hate you. I already have one of you. Be gone. But you were a high level. Hmm. TM40. Wild Rhyhorn, huh? Come with me. Be my friend. I said be my friend. Be my friend. I keep thinking that there's an extra step, like a extra paw, like a bait. After all those Pokeballs. Come on, Rhyhorn, be my friend. Nobody likes a Dine and Dasher. <laughs> you will win a prize. Gold teeth. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna make it. Maybe. I found a protein. That's gotta count for something. 
Ding dong. Time's up. Your game is over. Let me catch all the Pokemon in the park. Yes, 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 we've already done this rigmarole. Pikachu is having a nervous breakdown, staring into the fourth wall. Maybe we can finally test this. The classic bait makes them harder to catch, but less likely to run. But mud makes them easier to catch, but more likely to run. Interesting. I already have one of you. I missed this ball. Carbos. Ah, Marowak wants its baby. I throw a rock at you. And now I throw a ball. <laughs> it's angry, but it won't attack me. Come on, we should be friends. That's why I throw a rock at you. You're a ground type, aren't you? Fine, I'll run. Don't want to go that way. That's a trap. Yeah, but what's this way? I've got money to burn. I need... Apparently I need Surf to get that. Or go a different direction, probably. I already have you. I throw a safari ball. How dare you? I throw a safari ball. How dare you? The best Pokemon deterrent, annoyance. Get the Pokeball. Wait, nope, this is just same area. Ah, I went in circles. Look at all the time that I have waste. By time, I mean steps. Max Revive. Oh boy, once we get to that one uh, Pokemon season, we can revive Max. I shall throw a ball at you. I meant to throw a rock, but I missed. And now we'll finally see if that counts, maybe. Its horns contain venom. If they are stabbed into an enemy, the impact makes the poison leak out. That's disturbing. Rest house. Quit running away. Now this is... Wait. He said that it makes him easier to catch either way. Huh. Could be another Pokemon quirk. steps left, sir. Oh, we can't even get there. Where? 
I am a feel. Or we just need Surf to get there, but I don't have Surf yet. It could be one of those things where Surf just makes it easier. I don't need Ding dong. Just let me go through. I need to find Surf and the teeth. Now I just need to actually think of where to go. No, nope, can't go that way. For some reason, I thought I could. Nah. My brain. Lot of the needos. Not many Rhyhorns. I think I explored all to the right, but I'm just going off of my brain's telling of that, and it could be wrong. I already have a cube, oh, and you can go home to your mother, even though your mother is dead and on your head. already have you. Those stairs are a lie. Just trying to keep everything in mind is difficult. Just trying to think which way is what and where. Thinking is difficult. It's one of those times where I might need a map. Need a map, need a map, need a map. Khan. You should count for two. Come on. I'll throw a rock at you. And then I'll throw a ball at you. Come on. We should be friends. That Kangas Khan just doesn't know how to be friends. Trainer tips, the secret house is still ahead. That doesn't really feel like a tip. No room for items? Oh, fine, I'll destroy some. Escape ropes, I don't use at all. Gold teeth! Hell yeah. We can contribute to that. I think that might get us the diddly dee. <gasps> That's the secret house! We made it! I'll have to destroy quite a few things. I don't use elixirs. I don't even know what they do. Bye-bye, elixir. You're probably important. TM32. I could have sworn I already had a TM32. I could have just used those. Me dumb. Hmm. I think protein increases attack. So we should use it on someone else. Like you. And but Carbos, I think, increases special. So that should definitely go on Goblin. Ah, uh, speed, same thing. Ah, finally! You're the first person to reach the secret house! I was getting worried that no one would win our campaign prize. Congratulations, you have won! HM3! 
I did it. I won. And now I'm going to try... Since I don't have the ability to surf yet, I shall try some, uh, some fishing. Come to me, Dragonair. Don't be a Magikarp. Magikarp, no Magikarp. Magikarp, no... You're not even worth the bait. Well, at least I got most of the things that were, like, actually important here. Even if it is kind of a... Like, a funny thing was like, no, there's no grass here for you to actually catch Pokemon on the way to the secret house. Oh, it's a Dratini. You know, come with me, Dratini. Get in the ball, you cutie. I said get in the ball. How dare you run away from me? Get back here. I am your lovely friend. Come on out, Dratini. I said, come on out. Come on out, Dratini. Come on home. Hello there, Dratini. Get in the ball. I said, get the ball. It's the fun ball. Get in the fun ball. Routinis just don't know the meaning of fun. Guess I'm gonna have to throw rocks at him. Come on, Dratini. You forced me to throw rocks at you. Throw rock. Fine, I'll throw bait and maybe keep him around a bit longer. to be your friend because you are a fish. And you're also hard to level up. Kill Dratini. I will be your friend. Go away, Magikarp. Nobody likes you. No. I will move over a few spots. Obviously, Dratini will be over here. Dratini moved uh, Water tiles, addresses to get away from me. But I won't let that stop me. I see that the Dratini hired a bunch of Magikarp to annoy me. Maybe I'll run into another Kangaskhan. Hey, it must be fate. Here, have some bait. Stick around a while and listen. Safari Ball. What the fuck? Safari Ball. How are you missing the broad side of a barn? Why? How? Fine, I'll throw a rock at the child. Is that what you wanted? How could I miss the broad side of a barn so harshly? Hello, Rhyhorn. Get in the ball! Uh huh. I said, get in the ball! You are a mean Rhyhorn. I will throw a rock at you. It's super effective. Ball! My, yes. All these options certainly make them easier to catch, apparently. I shall throw another rock at you. Don't want you. Go away, Nidoran.
Ooh, a Scyther! Go, Pokeball! Come on, stay in the ball. I don't want the Nidoran line. I want Pokemon I haven't seen before. All right, Kangaskhan, get in the ball. All right, Scyther, I understand here, have some food. And you'll want to stay. And go Safari Ball. Okay, have a bit more bait. Maybe I just need to make him closer. And go Safari Ball. Go Safari Ball. It seems like the, the bait just makes them impossible to catch. But then sometimes if you throw the rock, it doesn't seem to help any anyway. So it's like, the combo is obviously throw rock and pray. The safari zone is weird. I'll, it's not what I wanted, I just wanted to throw rocks at it. I throw rock. Go away, you're ugly. Throw all the rocks. Throw all the rocks. Throw all the rocks. Of course, you stay around when I throw rocks at you. But Scyther, no. Why must you hunt me, Nido Ran Line? We have 33 more steps. I think all the Pokemon are determined to ignore me for those 33 steps. I shall cast a line into the sea. Go, Super Rod. Come to me, Dratini. I'll throw rocks at you. Of course, it's a magic card. How to cheese the system. Stay in one spot and uh, <laughs> super rot away. I don't need to listen to your rules. I can sit here and time won't pass. Catch a Dratini. Throw more of my balls at a Dratini. All right, Dratini. Please, ball. Come on. Fine, I'll throw a rock. Does that make you want to get in the ball more? Please. Why won't you get in the box? <laughs> it is kind of silly. It doesn't, like, even though he said, here's the rules of how this works, it doesn't feel like it. It doesn't feel like there's rhyme or reason to it. Sure doesn't feel like throwing rocks makes them easier to catch, it just means that the ball will actually hit. Go away, Magikarp. Nobody likes you. Why are you here? You don't you don't deserve to be protected. Not in a nature reserve. Try. 
have to try and get Dratini. It's right there in this puddle of water. Fine. You keep throwing the magic cup at me. I get the hint. I go. One, two, three. Ah. You can actually stop on zero and your time will never progress. And now we'll go talk to the Professor Oak Aid and see how many Pokemon we have left to catch. And then I'll probably uh, catch some off screen because there's still a few in the, the diddly D. Oh, but first we will return the teeth to the guy. Since we got the teeth, we'll go to the warden's house. You don't give the gold teeth to the warden. The warden popped in his teeth. Thanks, kid. No one could understand a word that I said. I couldn't work that way. Let me give you something for your troubles. HMO4. So I have... Wait, didn't I already... Uh, so how many HMs do I have? HMO3, which is... Surf. And then... I HMO4, which is Strength. Pokemon photos and fossils. And I know there's that, but I'll have to decide who to give strength to. That'll be slightly annoying. Because I don't have an HM slave. So I'll have to give some... I'll have to lose a decent move, probably, to use strength. But let's see, Professor Oak Aid. How many Pokemon do I need now to give you... I totally have caught 50. Only thing I need 12 more. Ay, ay, ay. But at least with Surf, that might be able to do something, but that means beating Koga. So, yeah, basically, what I'll do is uh, off screen, I'll do a bit of Safari grinding. I do believe that that will be it for now. We went for quite a while, but it's super fun. It's a very fun time. Having a lot of fun now that I'm actually on the right track, but then again, most of that right track was the Safari Zone, so eh. But hey, I got two more TMs that will make uh, progressing easier, especially that their surf, but even though I have to beat Koga to use it, that will be for next time. Anyways, thank you very much for watching. I've been Neon Icy Wings. This has been more Pokemon Critical Hit Edition. If you want more from me, you can see stuff on YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, Newgrounds, and other such social medias. And I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye-bye.